Okay, so uh, this script is pretty straightforward. I'm going to go and actually do a game with Navian, but I just want to go over some stuff really quickly. Uh, in a in Clean Sweep, which, by the way, shouts to Soup. This is a script that Soup wrote. Uh, this was their uh, this was their introduct or their submission. I think a long ass time ago. I don't remember what character it was for. Um, the character in or the thing in general is that yes, there are three fabled in this game. The gene, which I mean, the gene should be in any game that has a jinx. But sure, whatever. So you can kind of ignore that one because there are three jinxes. There's a spirit of ivory in play, which says that there can't be more than one extra evil player. So uh, the whole idea of there being like, say, a Fangu jump and a Mazepheles, it wouldn't work. So you got to be careful about that if you're evil or if there's any kind of weird barber shenanigans or something like that that might happen. Uh, and then lastly, the Stormcatcher. Uh, Soup has said that, as you can maybe tell by most of the things about this script, uh, that the Stormcatcher is intended, and the only reason why I'm telling you this is because it's this is going to be the case in every game of this script, so it's not something that's going to be have to be announced and decided at the beginning of the game. Uh, the Stormcatcher favors the Chambermaid in this game. Which, uh, if everybody, if anybody knows me, knows that I hate the fucking Chambermaid, so this script is actually kind of a big asshole to me, but, you know, whatever, I'll just deal with it. Um, everybody grab their seats, I'm gonna go craft a game with Navian, and we'll be back. Ooh, I do like art suggestion, Nadashi with a Scarlet Woman is kind of spicy, right? Because that poison moves. poison around, yeah, that's a, I do not hate that. I think I actually like that a lot. Um... Gifted subs for making Ryback the butler. Oh, oh, oh that's very tempting. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh boy yeah that could be fun um nodashi i don't want to do a widow i just don't feel like taking screenshots right now um would nodashi and scarlet woman mazephiles be too much because without the fangu the mazephiles is the only way they can get an additional player right and I think that they may need that. I just don't think that Serenovus is going to work well if we do the whole Nodachi Scarlet Woman thing. And I'm kind of lazy about doing a Widow, so it's kind of Mazepheles by default. <laughs> Fair enough, then. Uh, Barber obviously is also hysterical because we could move the Nodachi around again. Um, True. Uh, they could also swap their Mazepheles around and get a new Mazepheles word. Ooh, that's so, spicy. FYI. Ooh, that's spicy. I don't hate that. Um, all right, so let's do... Oh, wait, hang on. Is that is that a spirit of ivory I see on this script? It is. In that case, never mind. They yeah. could swap it around and it wouldn't matter. And so. it wouldn't matter. So they were basically <laughs> going to be aware that. of that. Uh, yep. As far as townsfolk are concerned, we could add an additional outsider via balloonist. Um, do we like King Choir Boy here? The problem is the, one of them is going to be poisoned. There's a strong chance one of them will end up poisoned. <laughs> uh, I think having Chef's starting info is probably really good. Obviously, there has to... We, there doesn't have to be a chambermaid, but, like, there probably should be a chambermaid. I think... I mean, okay, so if you don't put the Stormcaught character on, uh, like, in play, then it's basically just a free evil bluff because they know um, that nobody is the Stormcaught character. Therefore, they can claim it. And that'll explain why they never die at night. Yeah. Farmer could be a good way to knock this out. A poisoned farmer dying is rude. A poisoned farmer dying kind of uh, helps track down that Nodashi, but you know, that's why we got the Scarlet Woman in play. I think we do put in a farmer and just hope that a farmer eventually becomes poisoned and kills the farmer chain. Or turns that. evil and uh, poisons evil the farmer. farmer chain from the inside. Evil farmer. I love the sound of evil farmer. Um, all right. So if we play with chambermaid evil farmer, we need some more wakers. So let's give them flower girl. Let's let's avoid king choir boy this game. Let's do sure. a empath. No, let's do an oracle and a seamstress. Yeah, we can do that. Is that too much, though? That's a lot of info. 
Um, well, one thing we could do would be to take out one of those, put in the balloonist, and then we can add drunk. in an extra outsider. And make a drunk. Yeah. Uh, let's see. What would we get rid of? We would get rid of... Oh, we don't have to get rid of because we have a balloonist. Right. Mm, this is a wild game. This could be great. Uh, okay. Let's do that. Oh, uh, but if I do that setup, then the, the storm-caught chambermaid is going to be poisoned. Nope, we're re-racking. I'm sorry. Now the part now the farmer's poisoned. And the balloonist. Oh. Alright, we can we can change this. We can change this. Listen, two people are gonna be poisoned. You're right. You're gonna have to deal with it. I am going to do Oh, but that's such a good extension cord. If, you know what? I'm gonna do that. Um As Molobach has said with much outrage, you had Ryback as the butler and you re-racked. I well How I'm, dare. I'm gonna I'm gonna change it. Relax. You're going to put Ryback back as the butler? Yes. I'm going to make Ryback as the butler. I'm going to make Tori into the Slayer. And Look, we're doing good work for the Butler Innocence Project here at Mullabach. Poison... Uh, poison... I can't get a Poison Slayer. I kind of want a Poison Slayer. I'll swap Tori and Rez. Kale, Tori, Jose. Yeah, I can deal with this. Now there's no extension cord. Um, Skills needs a spot on the Grim. Skills needs a spot on the Grim? Yeah, hang on. Let me check who's not here. So Art. Bruce is here. Oh, right. Art. Okay. Rename Art to Skills. Cool. Uh, I have a DM. Let me check my DM really quick. It's going down in the DM. Uh, full script standard design if you want it. Yeah, I saw this. It was on uh, Jeff's site. I like this one better, though. I'm just going to keep this one up. Thank you, though, Batters. It's fancy. That was a big extension cord. It was. But we're going to we're gonna avoid the noise. Hey, did someone come through in a clutch? It sh they sure did. Mullybach gave out gift subs. Thanks, Mullybach. Uh, Dylan needs to be in for Be Messy. Yes, thank you. Rename to Dylan. Uh, Dylan becomes or was B Messy. Wait, B Messy's in the game. No, B Messy's not in the game. Yep, that is an exclamation point in front of B Messy there. All right, cool. Uh, can we get some honks for the gift subs? <laughs> Honk, 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 honk. I just did five honks, actually. Good for you. Yay. We were on the same wavelength. Um, God, I wish the honks came through. That I wish I could find a way to make that work. Um, I'm sure your wife can help you figure it out. My wife is really smart. Um, she's never going to watch this, but you're really smart, honey. Um, all right. I'm cool with this. Uh, I need a mez word chat. superfluous dude all right so get the fuck out of my head because that was literally a mez word i was thinking about last night like literally uh, clearly you transferred it to me yeah uh in connecticut we are all one entity we just have a single brain cell that we pass back and forth between each other last night was tomato's turn and today is mine dude i can absolutely believe that i am of one brain cell. I could totally buy that. Uh, okay. So, we're good to go. Uh, we're gonna go back. Um, it's Tori here, okay. so it should be only one word. Give it to me, Art. What's the final word? What should, what should, what should Tori's word be? I'm very scared to whatever this answer is. As Akin says, it's the final brain cell. <laughs> 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 All right, Princess Bride. Ooh, Un inconceivable. Two words. Inconce inconceivable. Okay, yeah, we need to swap it to inconceivable. 
yeah, I'm sorry. You're right. Art, you nailed you nailed it, buddy. It's inconceivable. Um, Buttercup, also a decent suggestion. You keep using that word. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think you. Why do you? Why do you I keep? Do using not that think word? it means what you think it means. It's because it's the mez word. Well done, Art. Well done. Um, this is going on YouTube already. I could already feel it. Um, all right. I feel like we're good. Oh, I need a metal album or magic card. Uh, oh yeah, I forgot we were doing that since before. For uh, I can't I can't conjugate that word right right now. So since we didn't do it during the speed TB. Yep. All right, let's head back. Literally can't. So about five minutes. Oh, is there, here. Never mind. I'll tell the story later. Anyway, hello I'll everybody. See you all on the stream. Good luck. We are going to go and do the thing. I am going to send you guys to sleep. Before I do, we are doing, for those of you who were not in chat, we are doing our mini game tonight, which is Metal Album or Magic the Gathering card. The next one I'm going to give you is Slip Through Space. Everybody go to bed. I'm going to send you to your rolls. Are we still? Oh, I cut off Dak. I'm going to go talk to Dak. What's up, Dak? I said, are we still in the same seats? Uh, should be in the same seats. I see everybody in their seats. Oh, you're saying a shuffle? Yeah. I eh, forgot shuffle. I fucked up the shuffle. It's fine. Uh, oh, all right. All right. All right. I'm going to send out characters and do stuff. Sounds good. Oh, well, I didn't shuffle, guys. It happens. Yeah, it's fine. All right, bring, sending out characters. All right, let's do some minion stuff. Let's go to Kale. Hello. Hello. Uh, your fellow minion is Tori. Yay. Your demon is Jose. Yay. And I'll be back. Uh, actually, I don't think we'll be back for Kale tonight. Right. Never mind. We won't be back ever. Hello, my love. Did you get your character? It would appear that they are. Oh, um, you know what we did do? We need to tell Kale about the storm cop. Oh, yeah. We should probably do that first, huh? Yeah. Let's just run back to Kale real quick. Okay. Kale, I lied. We actually did have to come back. Oh. Uh, the player, uh, I, I, it's by, it's player, correct, Navian? Correct, yes. So the player who is Stormcaught is Dylan. All right. Do we also learn what character right now? You will learn in the uh, morning, this, but. Yeah, but this script is specifically, it's the chambermaid, but it will be announced, um, in the morning anyway. Cool. Thank you. Let's try a different cabin. Sorry, that might have been me. I was getting a snack. That's fine. Uh, what are you having for a snack? Um, the bow buns. Okay. They're uh, like pork buns, but they've got like mushroom and other stuff in them, so they're not piggy. Right. They're vegany. Yes. Uh, hello. Uh, yes. I. I might have. I might have screamed in victory oh you wanted to be the mez or oh, mez turn either way well we'll figure that out in a little bit but first i got some info for you your uh fellow minion mm. is kale okay your demon is jose and okay cool yep yep mm -mm -mm. uh yeah the storm caught player is dylan so that means they can't die at night. Correct. Right? Okay. Yeah, they can only die by execution. Awesome. What's the gin thing? I was distracted. Uh, so when the gin is basically any jinxes. So technically, okay, if we're it running, is just jinxes. Yeah, cool. if we're running a script that has jinxes, there should be a gin in there, or any other kind of house rules or anything like that. But in this case, okay. it's just jinxes. Thank yep, you. and um, if you need to reference those, if you uh, hit mm. the R button um, and you scroll yep. down to the bottom of the script, it has the list of all the jinxes. Cool, got those. Thank you so much. Uh, Wait, some... so Jose is my demon, right? I just wrote Jose is your demon. Yep. Yep. 
Uh, I have. I can also tell you that uh, someone mm -hmm. in chat says that your bow, your fake bow buns, your your faux mm -hmm. bow, are really good. Yeah. Good. I'm glad. Yeah. That's such a weird comment to get, but yay. Well, I don't, I don't know if it's yay. the same brand, but you know, whatever. I don't know. It's some random brand I get from some random store, but they're the only ones I found, and they're real tasty. All right, I'll be back. So, yeah. All right. Thank you so much. No Bye. No probs. Hola. Hello, hello. Uh, I am here to tell you that your minions are yes. kale. Oh, oh, wait, oh, wait, hold on. My computer. Give me one second, sorry. Take your time. This is not speed TV. Okay. Oh, good, good. Thank God, yeah. Okay, kale, okay. And Tori. Yes, I was hoping Tori would be evil. Uh, awesome. And your bluffs are cannibal. I was hoping for cannibal. Empath. Uh, okay. And seamstress. Perfect. Do I learn anything else, King or Stormcatcher? You do learn that the uh, the storm caught care or the storm caught player is Dylan. Dylan. Do I also learn the role or no? I forget you, how that works. You will learn the role. Town will learn the role in the morning. Together. Got it. Okay. Yep. Uh, just to be cl to clarify, no king. I have not I told you about king. a king. Okie dokie. Sounds good. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. And let's go to this person next. We are back, darling. Yep. Your mez word. Navian gave it to me. Navian gave it to you? But do it. Do it anyway. I'll pretend. Hang on. We'll, we'll rerun this. No, okay, no, no. Na no, no. Navian, you killed it, man. It's okay. I love you anyway. <laughs> do, do it, it anyway. Give me, give me the word. Oh, because you want to. She's want gonna clip? have the same response. Yep. All right. Well, this is for this is for YouTube. If you guys are watching, this is for okay, you. This is for the content. This is the content. Your mez word is inconceivable. Ugh, of course, it is that fucking god awful movie. Hey, go. at least you know what it's a reference to. Yeah, I've seen the movie. That's why I know I don't like it. Well, some people <laughs> formulate opinions on things without actually seeing them. Well, I, I try or watch the thing. And then I am confirmed that I know that it is terrible. Okay. Well, I oh. will see you later. Well, I'm excited for chat to scream for my blood that I have expressed this correct opinion again. Oh, yeah. Chat, if you guys are not familiar uh, and for anyone watching on YouTube, I have to start catering shit to YouTube. Um, Tori believes that uh, The Princess Bride is a bad film. And there is someone else in this game who shares that opinion. Um... And I can tell you that if you are watching this on YouTube and you have an opinion about The Princess Bride, leave a comment because it helps us. And but, also, but also be aware, if me not liking The Princess Bride creates such a visceral response in chat or within yourself that you want to kill someone, it feels like a you problem. And maybe you should look at how you react to other people's opinions of things. I, just... I would say if that's your response, <laughs> you should probably get some help, yes. Yes. I mean, that's literally the whole game, apart from me. You know that, right? <laughs> well, I've been killed day one for it. This has been a very exciting. <laughs> this has been a very exciting mez uh, word step in the night order. Uh, but unfortunately, I still have many other things to do. So I will be talking to you later. Thank you and bye. All right. Uh, hello. Are you there? JR. Hello, sir. Can you Hello, hear me? Navian. Look at look, just, with your sexy voice. How about that? Yes. Uh, I would like to inform you that you wake up and are shown a hand signal that remember that resembles the number zero. Mm. Oh, you cut out. Zero. Zero. Or a one or confirmed a two. zero is indeed a number. Yeah, shouts to Capella. Uh, I'm very thankful for the Arabs for creating that number about, I don't know, 500 to 1,000 years ago. It's a very helpful number, that one. Did you say 500 yeah, to 1,000 years ago? Yeah, apparently zero is a relatively recent number. Uh, it's, I think it's a little more... I think it's a little older than that, though. Eh. I'll do some research. Someone can do some research. Chat. Uh, also, YouTube comments. Tell me how old zero is. I love this YouTube thing. Wait, I get wait, to just wait. chill. We're on YouTube now? Oh yeah, we're on YouTube now. Is content poisoning on YouTube yet? Uh, it... 
It is a planned throwback Thursday for the future. Because I need to show everyone that game. It is the greatest game ever played by everyone involved. To the fact that we know what that game is just by referring to it as content poisoning should tell you how seminal of a game that was. Yeah, it should probably go into our archives if we've got an archive here. We have an archive! Yay! All right. Okay, I'll be... so according to this history.com article that I have just looked up, yep. uh, the first recorded use of a zero-like symbol dates to sometime around the 3rd century BC in ancient Babylon. Yeah, see? It was the Middle Easterns. Like I said... Um, a full grasp of zero's importance would not arrive until the 7th century AD in India. What the fuck is going um, on in does... game chat? <laughs> uh, well, yes, India, also known as also uh, Western Asia. By the 9th century, zero mm -hmm. had entered the Arabic numeral system in a form resembling the oval shape we use, oval shape we use today. And as we both so. know, the Middle East is in the Middle East. Yes. But yeah, um, so the Arabic numeral system uh, got zero as we kind of know it today uh, in the 9th century, although the concept of basically zero has been around for quite some time. Like, mm -hmm. we're talking uh, Sumerian scribes used spaces to denote absences in number columns as early as 4,000 years ago. Yeah, now we use spaces as a way to uh, separate words, which I think is much more efficient. Yeah, when we post this on, um, when we can someone clip this and just at Capelli in the unofficial, I think that'll be great. Uh, uh, also, um, <laughs> could <sighs> no, I forgot what I was going to say. Never mind. Anyway, I will talk to you later because so, this is the longest yes, chef. Thank info you for role. my number. Yeah, this is the longest <laughs> I've ever spent with a chef. Uh, well. Except well, for that I'm time in it. college, but we're not going to get into that. I will talk to you later. Okay, bye. Hello. Hello. Right back at your favorite role. <laughs> I'm going to get myself killed as fast as I can. Uh, until then, Bruce. You are buttling Bruce. Yep. Thank you very much. And let's go to that person next. Except we're not going to that person next because I don't know what the fuck to tell Dakota. Uh, I still have to use token integrity as to what tokens I'm putting down. Um, do we... The only true number is Juggler 5. It's true. Do we show... Which art got without having to juggle the spy? Have you been waiting to say that? Um, No. Okay, I feel it like just you. Popped I, up, I was gonna say, I feel like you've been waiting on that for one while. for a while. Good for you, Art. Good, good for me too, as a politician and using the spy. But fine, you're right. I, as, like I said, I bend the knee to Art. Art got it legit. Um, who do we show, Dakota? Can we show Bruce as a towns? Can we just show Bruce as a demon? Um, no. Oh, wait. Dakota's poisoned. Yes, yeah. we could. Let's show Bruce as a demon. I like that. Let's show Bruce as a demon. Because content. All right. Uh, yeah, I mean, Dakota's poisoned. It doesn't really matter who but we I know, show but, here. But it matters what token I put down, because integrity. Yes, it does. I would suggest that on a later night, we double up on... Um, Oh, you put the token on skills instead of Bruce. Oh, sorry. But yeah, we should double up on what uh, type of player we're showing. So it's like, you know, we've shown one townsfolk, even though they have the demon token. So we should show another townsfolk at some point and put whatever other token we want on them. Yeah. In fact, we could show all townsfolk. We could just show all townsfolk. Yeah. Yeah, we could just show all townsfolk. Uh, all right, let's go to Dakota. Hello. Hello. I wake you up and I show you Bruce. Thank you so much. You timed that perfectly with the end of my song. Did I? Yeah. I guess I'm just a fucking... The Australian... 
the Australian band were just like the big outro, and then you just came in, hello, perfect. I guess I'm just a fucking baller. Okay, okay, bye. Ooh. Hello. Please choose two players. Oh boy, okay. Hello. Uh, this is exciting. I would like to choose Tori and Dakota. Tori and Dakota. Uh, I will give you a two. A two? Yeah. Interesting. There we Very go. Very interesting. Ooh. All right, I'll this be back. Exciting. Yes, chat. I know. I never put down a drunk. Um, unfortunately, it needs to be either the flower girl or the oracle at this point. It could also be Resnora, even though I understand, of course, that she's uh, poisoned, which would make the Nodashi poison travel to the farmer, or it could just be the farmer. It could just be the farmer. It I... could be, quite frankly, any of the players that we have visited, except for JR, uh, because a drunk could still get true information, right? There's, uh, well, we Dylan. can't do Dylan because that's a Stormcaught character, mm -hmm. yeah. Uh, but technically, Dakota could be the drunk, and then we could go back to Dylan and make that the poison storm caught chambermaid, who just happened to get true info on night one. Um, but I wouldn't recommend that. I would say Dak, Malishan, best choices, Bruce or Rez, second best choices. Dak's info. Which, which information is going to be more. Malishan's info has to be more powerful this game than Dak's, right? Um, possibly. I mean, it's hard to say. All right, chat. I'm making an executive decision. I am going to choose Dak. Um... Oh, yeah. Mola box, right? Dakota couldn't actually be the drunk because then there's no extra outsider yes, added. You are, you correct. are correct. Look at you, Mola box. You're so smart. Thank you for jo showing up here and showing that even people like Navy and I who have been doing this for literally almost a year now on stream, we are small smooth pecan brains you speak for yourself sir i have a very wrinkly brain i just have a lot going on right now you have a five head <laughs> a permanent <laughs> five head um yeah but yes uh, so art's right in this analysis here so a drunk oracle hides the fact that there's a scarlet woman better probably uh whereas a drunk flower girl just completely hides where any demon is but they may be able to potentially detect a scarlet woman jump from that um i mean malishan if if there is a scarlet woman jump malishan is going to end up poisoned at some point anyway yeah um or dak right no matter which one we pick one of them is going to end up poisoned but it's probably easier to hide the poison uh on malishan than it would be on dak uh, L. James, thank you for the follow. And yes, Art, when you are an elder spawn, you do have a larger brain than a human. It's true. All right, let's send it back. Hello, chat. I was actually still in kind of like hyper TB mode where I was about to give you guys only four minutes to figure out what the hell is going on, but I decided that maybe that was a bit rude. So we are going to just start with the typical narrative, which is... A, a squished tomato and a butchered goose. But more importantly... Actually, there's really nothing more important than that. How, what could it possibly be more important than the storytellers dying? Uh, specifically, this particular pair of amazing storytellers that you have every week. Um, in addition to that, I would like to let you know that the Stormcatcher has favored the Chambermaid. What a shock. Everybody knows that. Uh, I will give you guys 10 minutes after I tell you that slip through space is something. Which one is it? I don't remember. Let me find out. Uh, something. Congratulations. <laughs> congratulations to the people who voted on something. Well done. Yay, okay, we win. <laughs> Yay. Uh, we all did it. Uh, I got this. If... I'm smart. I know how to do this, guys. We're at the edge of our seats. Can't wait. Uh, just so you know, on stream, we can see what your, like, browser is doing. Sorry, I did it on the wrong screen. <laughs> Thanks, chat. Yeah. yeah. You, too. Oh, you did that yeah. earlier, tomato, too. You and your, your, your nice. tomato porn tomato. Yeah. It was I'm interesting just, stuff. I'm just impressed that your computer is still running with as many porn tabs open. Excuse yep. me. Ah! <laughs> Catch. 
it's yeah we we do we call it we call it ketchup porn in the industry um your next one is going tomato to be tomato sauce yes tomatoes uh, when you get the tomato sauce as to where everything is coming from um depends on what orifice it's coming from anyway so the next one is going to be oh. god <laughs> iron I hate it, yeah. bully and noms are in 10 Mila, Sean, let's go can i have a conversation would you like to chat? Oh, sorry. What? What's up? Hey, what? Dakota, sorry. do you want to chat? Who wants to talk? Does... Was that a yes? I'm yes, sorry. Sorry. I, who are you, Tori, who are you talking to? Oh. Mm. Uh, JR? Uh, who wants me? If it I helps, Kevin, you. I still sorry, use it. Yeah, I yeah, still no, input it as much. Anyone with JR? So, uh, skills, let's talk. Let's go, Bruce. <laughs> right. JR, I'll talk to you, JR. Hell yeah. Uh, why, why, why are you so quiet all of a sudden? I am thinking. Um... Are you going to lie to me? Like, I straight up just told you the truth, and you're spending an awfully long time thinking about what you're going to say in response. I am. I'm the flower girl. No, you're not. I am. If I was lying to you, I would have told you that I'm the chef. Fine. I'm gonna put farmer, flower girl, and seamstress in my three. <laughs> okay. That's almost exactly my three. That's good. But, uh, personally, I think this is gonna be kind of a straightforward game for me. Uh... Meg gave me that word because of that. Um... Yeah. The dong. Wh which one of our favorite couple do you want, Tori? You want Dong or Rez? I'll take whoever you um, don't want. I know which I'll one Tori Marshall. wants. Excuse me? Okay, I'll take Rez. Oh, Rez. Let's go to the aquarium. Hey, Skulls. <laughs> Fancy meeting you here. I uh, know, interesting. I, uh... no. jokes, jokes on Tori, I would have chose you anyways. Um, What you want to <laughs> do? Um, I'll. What do you want to do? It's, you know what? I asked you to come here. Uh, I'll let you decide. Uh, let's do threes. I am the farmer, the flower girl, or the seamstress. I am the flower, the balloonist, or I am the oracle. All right. Well, if you don't have nothing else for me, I will be going. We're not. <laughs> I thought that you might have been the widow, but then I was like, no, you couldn't be the widow because CB's obviously lying. There's no way they would have the magician yeah. see the widow pig, right? Of course not. So I thought yeah. maybe CB was the demon for a brief moment. But I was like, wait. <laughs> I'm like, ooh, let's talk to CB. And then I talked. I didn't talk to CB, but I talked to Resnora and Resnora. Uh, did not sound demon-y to me. <laughs> Alright, so, what do you want to do here? We could do whatever you want. I will figure out where you went. Ah, fair enough, I just vanished. Um, uh, you're my neighbor, aren't you? Yes, you are. Hi. Uh, hi. Uh, I got some exciting news for you. Uh, oh, yeah. I, I am the local cat boy in a cloud, uh, otherwise known as the chambermaid. Huzzah! Cat boy so, in a cloud? Yeah. I do not we'll know. Just... I mean, storm court, I guess, but I don't yeah. figure out what the rest of that means. <laughs> so what does that mean? Who do you think about only? Me? That would be a very good educated guess. <laughs> Hot damn. All right. Cool. I like, uh, I'm I like. Of course, if I'm the butler, I'm buttling you. Oh, yeah. You have to buttle me. That's correct. I hope you buttle me this whole game. One plus two plus one plus one. One plus two plus one plus one. I don't yep. know what that means, but I really appreciate it. And there's nobody in town, so we can keep talking. You don't know that. No, you're fine. It just took me a second to find you. I'm like, where the hell did he? Oh, there he is. Yeah, I've done the bit now. I should change it back. Um, what do you want to do? Uh, I'm good with doing whatever you want. I'll give you a three today. I've done a one and a couple of twos. Um, okay. F Oracle or Farmer. Oracle, Farmer, and what else? Yeah. Okay, I will tell you, um, Slayer, Flower Girl, or Oracle. I will be right back. Okay. Sounds good. 
All right, thank you. Thank you. I should have gone back to town square first. The flower girl. So in my perspective, Malashan is either Sarah Novus that's flower girl, or Malashan is hard is a pixie flower girl, or Malashan is just a minion. I'm gonna the same could be said today. about skills. <laughs> Malashan's not a demon. Uh, because <laughs> there's no way. What are you planning to go with? I'm going with either Cannibal or Seamstress. If Tori's the Widow, I want to take Cannibal, but if she's not, then I'm going to um, go with Seamstress. I have, what? luckily, already put Cannibal and a Seamstress in a two. Oh, okay, perfect. So we can kind of go either way, depending on what happens, right? Um, I'll probably take Seamstress, because I feel like that's less likely. Balloonists aren't real, it's true. Yeah, I agree. So you couldn't hear any of that? <laughs> they made it just that he was deafened. Um, I couldn't hear anything. <laughs> I was like, they're the being so be. quiet. <laughs> We're just sitting here in silence. <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, let's just say I asked you a question earlier that you could answer later. Just say yes. Like, just say oh, and to the answer your stream deck now has a clip it button yes in case I think that the past 30 okay, seconds... Okay, yes, person stress, anything else can I think that's how that works, yes. at least. Okay. Someone could check that for me. Alrighty. Awesome. The Oracle. Go the Oracle. Mm -hmm. uh, Alright. I am the chef. We're neighbor numbers. Number neighbors, right? yes. Yeah, number neighbors, neighbor number whatever. Come on. <laughs> what number did you get? I got a zero. Thanks, Art. That's and I'm fun. going to be telling. Yeah, wife. I'm going to be telling town <coughs> tomorrow first thing. In case Why anybody tomorrow? doesn't know, and she's never watching, but if she uh, is, because that's what I told the kills. You're a boss. And I realized I didn't. I tell him flower girl, and then I talk to Ryback, thinking Ryback's going to be my backup, and then I talk to you, and I just trust him. I mean, most importantly. Okay. So, uh, in my world, we should kill Skills because Skills is probably evil. In double my clan. world, we should kill Malishan, because Malishan is probably evil in a double clan. Alright, we need to pick somebody else to kill then. <laughs> I agree. <laughs> We're not going to agree who to kill today, so we have to kill somebody else. Who are Let's we going to kill? kill? I don't Sussan know. That is Sussan. correct, DC Sensei. Uh, uh, Ryback is claiming butler and says that I'm the master, so I love Ryback for the rest of this game. Anybody okay. who lets me be the master, I'm all about. So protect Ryback at all costs. But do we really want to have another situation where we have a butler go all yeah, the Yeah, but the, but the butler was a good one, right? Um, um, also, it's a thing. It's also it's a Fangu script, so... Mm, so he's not I'm, the demon yet. So, it, I mean, he I could honestly be the demon now we and be claiming <laughs> outsider. You know what? That's but, true. <laughs> but honestly, I, I would... I, I'm so confused by dragon. Is that wait, what? I get it now. The dragon. Drag. Okay, dragon. Okay, dragon. Anyway. Dra Jose. Jose. Anybody? Yes. From earlier. Yes. Okay. Sounds good. Do your thing, guys. Uh, I will open up Nam shortly. <laughs> I 
dying. Three people, and I've heard of two double fives. Have we? Tori, stop dying. Damn. Sorry. Um, I would like to know what we're looking at for outsiders. Do we think we have a Fangu game? Do we think we have the not Fangu game? Yeah. Because we can have uh, all it... four. Ooh. One yeah, thing... is it, is it, yeah, is it possible to get anything other than two and three in this game? Four. Yeah, four Not with balloonist. The balloonist. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, uh, I've only heard of one, so. I haven't heard, heard of one. So I'd we like can't have ask... one. Sorry, go ahead. Sorry. Uh, I'd like to ask if anyone's like heard about a widow floating around. No. 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 Nope. And not a not a lot of um claims that would make me think it either. <laughs> You know, like the fake widow claims. Mm -hmm. Yeah, undertakers and such, or whatever. I mean. Gotcha. Yeah. Oh wait, 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 wait. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Hold up. Uh, my audio's been having your troubles. I uh, I saw the widow pit claim. I didn't tell anyone because I didn't want like people to like think I was the widow doing that. But yeah, I saw the widow. Okay. Oh, okay. Cool. Um, I told I told okay. Tori I told I told Tori on my very first conversation. I asked her. I asked her not to say it out loud, though. That's why she didn't just do the thing, because Tori Sorry. loves me and will uh, re and do the things for me. Noms are open. Okay. I have a, I have a Dakota blind spot. I can't help it. <laughs> anyway, you sound manufactured. Um. Okay. <laughs> so. So did someone say that you have heard of one outsider? Do we know what that that outsider claim is? I guess. Oh, there's a fungal in the script, so maybe they don't want to come up. I'm not going to say who, but I have heard somewhere from someone who said they spoke to someone, so take that as it will, that we have a butler in play somewhere. That doesn't... Um, I mean, that's... Looking at this, that's the one that I would expect to, you know, kind of put out there to people. Like, we're not going to find a drunk easily. A barber's probably going to want to keep that close to the chest. Uh, and... Depending on who the klutz is, if we have a klutz, they may want to keep it to themselves, or they may want to be open about it with people. It really depends. So, um, can I ask Jr. Who yeah. would you be willing to die? I am, but I was going to wait and see if there were any other nominations first. All right, thank see you. See what people felt. Second call for nominations. Oh. I did it again. Uh, no, no one. All right, Jr. Nominates Jr. JR nominates JR. Uh, it sounds like town doesn't know what to, who to go for, so might as well go for the chef. JR nominates JR. Why? Uh, I am the chef. <laughs> and it doesn't look like there's another role in this script that would be happy to die day one, so. Thank you. Uh, it, might, might as well go for the chef. It reminds me of ideally, or sorry, it, I have to do it as an aside. Uh, when you said, I'm the chef. Uh, it reminds me of, in case anyone has never seen it, the clip from Police Squad of probably the greatest comedic line of all time, which I'm going to post in chat. Um, give it a look. It's hysterical. And it's probably the greatest comedic line of all time. But more importantly, we would need six for this to pass. Uh, let's keep the votes to a minimum. There is a flower girl. So mm. just six... Yeah. Yeah, let's yeah, keep it I would, Yeah, yeah, yeah. we could. So that, I can't count, as I proved earlier. Okay. Oh, it's, it's six now. If, yeah, we have it on yeah. Sorry, Sorry there is, is a flower girl, or in case there's a flower girl? I, uh, I, I think there's a flower girl. Okay, thank six you. Six is enough. JR is on the block. Any other nominations? Thank you for your service, JR. <laughs> See, my objective was to die early, so you all starve to death. Bye. Be before you die, can you get in the damn kitchen and make me a sandwich? That's right. That's what cannibals for. Go back to sleep. Get us a meal. And starve. Ending the day in five, four, <laughs> three, two, one. Jr. What is your preferred method of death? Giving everyone dysentery. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, Jesus. I can tell you. Why, thank you. I can tell you that JR is 
a guy who is yeah I I was trying to come up with a good joke I just couldn't fucking come up with one this you're dysentery doing, thing great. dysentery thing really uh, threw me off um, that's what dysentery does uh, I throw, throws you off of something that's it throws something off um, congratulations do you, want, do you want an alternative death uh you know what keep it in your back pocket maybe you'll uh, maybe you'll come back to life oh wait there's no there's no Al Hadiki on this script that was last game you think uh jr is executed and does not survive and <laughs> i am here to tell you that congratulations you guys learn that iron bully is a magic card your next one for tonight is oh we're talking about oregon trail and chat nice guys well done uh no, i want to get the card game i heard there's a card game i heard that's a thing um, your next one that I'm going to do is something I already chose that I can't remember. Uh, oh, right. Your next one is Reign of Tears. Everybody go to sleep. Welcome to Dysentery. <laughs> Welcome to Dysentery. Uh, Are we really having done Reign of Tears before? Uh, I can confirm we have not done Reign, Reign of Tears. Or something. We did Reign of Something. There's There are four Reign Ofs on this list. Yeah, that tracks. That tracks. Um, Alright, so. Uh, we get a Mez. We get a Mez today. That's cute. Uh, we sure do. Let's do that now, actually. It's first on the list. Yeah, where is there? Patters, your bot. Hello. Hey. Uh, Art has gifted a sub. Thank you, Art. That was very generous of you. Um, also, you are evil. Yay! And I will be back with your Balanist stuff in a little bit. Thank you. Yep. Uh, I go to that person next. Yeah, that person. Please choose a player. Um, let's go with Malashan and hope he's not the farmer. You go with Malashan. Okay. Thank you. Yep. I go where next? That and then that. Numbers. Numbers. Numbers are fun. Numbers are fundamental. Oh shit! I'm I'm out. Hello, Bruce. You say Bruce? I do. Okay. Thank you. You. Yep. Uh, where do I go next? That person. Ooh. All right. What do I tell Dak? Uh, well. I mean, I feel like giving a one this early might really make suspicious. Dak think a little too quickly yeah. that he is the drunk. I think I give uh, a zero. Yeah, JR gave himself up really, really early, and at this point, it. You know, we could manufacture an early Fengu jump, but I'm not sure that that would track. So I think a zero for tonight, and then depending on what happens tomorrow, maybe tick the number up. What does a broken butt look like? Uh, probably, you know, your your all those little tiny bones in your tail, your tail bones being kind of free floating. Cause I'm free, free floating. Coxix. Imagine, yeah, cracked, a cracked coxix. Ooh. Does not sound pleasant. No. Uh, there's a guy, Chris Webby, that's a rapper, I believe, from today. I think Chris Webby is actually from. I think he's from Bridgeport. Good night, good night, uh, Jeff. Thank you for your help. Uh, and I have only was able to find these two scripts tonight because of your site. So. Uh, everybody go and go to uh, the site to do the thing and do the thing. 
If I was a rapper, I'd call myself Cracked Coxix. Bars. Um, there's some bars in chat going down right now. I'm not going to rap them. I'm sorry. Um, yeah, I think we give a zero to Dak. Yeah, uh, we don't want to give away that he's the drunk quite so early. Yeah. It'd have a big butt in it. <laughs> Thanks, butt spot. You're alive! Hello. I give you a... Zero. Zero. Yep. Okay. Figured so much. And that's the benefit of giving the expected thing to drunk players early on, because then they will not think that they are the drunk later. Uh, Malachan's a huge kill, by the way. We didn't talk about oh. this. Nice. Malachan is in... Uh, oh, I still have to do Dakota. Shit. Uh, <laughs> do I just say Jose? No. No? No. Um, I, I mean, Dakota we... knows that she's evil, uh, but I am assuming that she's going to get back with Tori and just get the team. Um, I think... We just I get think... Tori? Yeah, I think Tori is worthwhile to give. Sure. Do we say that Tori is an outsider? Uh, sure. Why not? So we have to think. Okay, so let's think. For, let's let's think this through for a second, because I want to actually I want to talk this out to see if we are. Webby's from Norwalk. Okay, thank you, Nate. I Webby. would say, okay, I would say that it almost doesn't matter what we tell Dakota as long as Dakota and Tori talk again, because as soon as Dakota gets the whole evil team those pings are going to be adjusted and made up by Dakota anyway, um, most likely. Counterpoint. So, and the counterpoint is that if they don't talk, then giving somewhat believable pings would be probably important to do. That was not my counterpoint. In case, in case they just give out their actual things. Uh, my counterpoint was in the case that we do have a Scarlet Woman swap and Dakota becomes sober, we want right. to we want to know which tokens we still want to actually give Dakota. So Well, yeah, we do need to know that. Uh, it just almost at this point doesn't matter who we're choosing for our night to who to show. The thing is, um I suggest that we give one of the other townsfolk uh, so that we have this, even if Dakota later becomes unpoisoned, if, you know, Dakota is giving out poisoned info, it, it, it is actually poisoned. Because if we show a townsfolk now as the demon and then a, a minion as, like, they're going to have too much info that could be t potentially good. Like, just double up on something. Why not? But Tori's also a decent choice. Well, so the, the only rationale I have is I think we're of two minds in this. You want to do with the whole all townsfolk thing. Uh, if Tori and Dakota talk today, Dakota is going to know that their info is bunk. Right. But that also means that I think that if we show Tori as a minion, Dakota will now at least have two names, one of which she knows is a minion. She'll know right. who her demon is, so Bruce will not be the demon. And then if they become sober for the next two days' worth of info... Like, if Jose dies, for instance. Uh, yeah. Then it would suggest that once Dakota starts getting info, that Bruce is one of the people and two of the other players are the other people. I think that if we show Minion, we've now shown Demon. I think if we leave ourselves... It it's the, makes the most sense to leave open Townsfolk and Outsider in the case that that happens. That's just my thought process. Yeah. No, I think I think that's fine, yeah. Okay. Let's go to Dakota. If if Dakota weren't turning evil, I would probably have a stronger opinion on this and and uh agree with your reasoning. I just know that Dakota's evil, so Right, exactly. Alright, let's go down to Dakota. Hello, Dakota. I am going to show you Tori. Tori, lovely. Thank you. You're very welcome. Please choose two players, Dylan. Uh, may I please choose Tori and Malachan? Tori and Malachan, you get a zero. Interesting. Thank you. You're very welcome. Ooh, that's rough. 
So choosing Malishon there is actually pretty. Choosing Malishon there is pretty brutal. Um, yeah. Um, I think that the biggest um, tripping point for Evil is going to be this Stormcaught Chambermaid. Uh, they're basically going to have to eventually push a world where Dylan is evil and therefore knows that there is no Chambermaid in play and is therefore bluffing it. Otherwise, uh, they might end up getting caught out. Yeah. Um, they really, I mean, once they realize, I, it, I think they're going to realize, hey, we're doing pretty okay here. And then they're going to be like, oh, shit, we have to do something about this. We have to do something about this oh, chambermaid. Oh, apparently uh, I wasn't paying attention to Dylan's actual choices. Dylan has to rechoose. Uh, one of the players was dead. All right. Guys, there are clips out there. Navian will probably find them for you. In case it wasn't clear, I fucking hate the chambermaid. This is exactly why. Uh, this is exactly why. I'll pay more attention to the chambermaid picks in the future, I promise. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll also do so. Apologies, Dylan. I actually need to have you reselect. Ooh, interesting. Um, I would like to select uh, Dak and Tori in that case. You choose Dak and Tori. Is that legal? That is a legal choice. And awesome. you get a one. One. Gotcha. Okay. Thank you. I fucking hate the chambermaid. Okay. Uh, I love the chambermaid. I know you do. In case anybody hasn't seen it, Navian wrote an entire script for me that was just every... Oh, it was 25 chambermaids. Yeah, um, it is titled Script to Annoy Chris. It was a really good one, too. Uh, yep. I uh, hand-colored all of those chambermaids into evil chambermaids, and then Jack went and used his, you know, the, the fancy thing that he does in Photoshop where he... Uh, runs something he runs a script to make fancy looking scripts and he he made one with all the evil chambermaids on which i believe this picture from soup is actually a prototype from oh yeah yeah that it makes looks sense. very jackie right it does yeah it looks like maybe um sort of the first design that beta. he did yeah because jack's a beta Let's not no, use no. a bunch of shitty, lame, wrong terminology. Yeah, I'm not a big fan of the whole alpha beta bullshit, so. Uh, I mean, it's literally bullshit because it's predicated on uh, science that has long since been refuted and proven to be incorrect. Navian, this is why I love having you around, because you just make it so that bullshit is not... It is, you don't tolerate the bullshit. I usually just walk past it, but you don't tolerate the bullshit, which is why I love having you around. Well, thank you. I appreciate that. Chat, can we get some more for Navian? I'm going to give a couple honks. Alright, let's send everybody back. Nope, that's Dusk. I don't want Dusk. Good morning, everybody. It has been a eventful night. Lots of things happened. Uh... Which, of course, means that Malishan is dead. Tomorrow. Noms are... Oh, wait, I have a thing to do. Uh, didn't I do a thing? What was the one I gave you? Oh, Reign of Tears. Mm -hmm. It's a magic card. All right. They're so, all magic. They're not all magic. All right, your next I one... I think they have been so far tonight. No, I gave you one album. Uh, your next yeah, one no. is Awaken the Bear and Metal Noms in <laughs> eight minutes. Uh, yeah, sure, Jose. I'll have a chat for you. Uh, yeah, I'll follow you. Holes, can we chat? I don't know, Bmesu. This is just on my thing. I don't green know. card, but mm, it's so metal. Yeah. Did someone uh, have to speak to me? I do. Let's go. In the bluffs, so yeah, I'm the Mazepheles, Kale Skeleton Woman, your Nodashi, which means Dakota's information is wrong, but that's fine if I've she's evil. Um, um, this, do, what, is what is Dakota? Do you know what she is? Uh, balloonist, sorry. She okay, oh, balloonist. she didn't lie to me. Wow, okay. Uh, yeah, okay. so she claimed Balloonist, which is fine because it can still work for our favor. Um, so Cannibal, yep. Seamstress, and Empath of the Bluffs, I think you're taking Kale Seamstress. Did Kale see what they wanted? So uh, he and I were discussing taking Cannibal and Seamstress, and then we had a code. Oh, uh, we, well, we yep. were saying yes to Seamstress, but I don't know. Which one of us is taking it? 
Okay, so he said that you were taking it. Okay, um, I am so taking seamstress. That, that actually works out well because I was telling I had to card claim to Malashan. Just yeah, uh but, You know what? Why don't just... we have Malashan come down because yes. I'm gonna take a slayer shot based on who it was, so let's have oh wait. Malashan could join us because we are in Malashan has permission to enter Dudley Town if we're in Dudley Town, right? Yeah. Nope. I think so. Nope. No. Nope. Alright, well why don't we we're uh just go Pig's Eye Pub and then have Malachan. Pig's Eye Pub. Cool. I will keep that in mind. They gotta get rid of Thank you. Thank you. Alright, bye bye. Bye. Oh, for town's benefit, me and Dylan Dylan said they were the storm caught chambermaid and I pulled up a bunch of bullshit. Sorry, I ran away. Sorry. No, that's fine. I was actually talking to Dakota. Oh. Yeah. Sorry. No, you're good. No, you're all good, Dylan. Well, that was close. Thank you for saving that. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. All right, bye. Okay, bye. Shit, one. I... You can't be evil next to Dakota, right? It can't... That's not a chef zero. It's a chef zero. Yeah. It's a chef zero. Sorry, sorry, sorry. It's a chef zero, not a chef one. Sorry, it's a chef yeah, zero. Chef zero. Chef zero. That's what okay, I meant. Yeah. So, so it'll still look like that, even though you have Okay, so here's the problem. Malashan and Rez probably swapped roles because I think Malashan was Plow Girl and that's why I killed him. So, uh, but in that case, I will leave Rez alone because she's just getting yeah. poison information. Yeah, okay. so you gotta be careful because uh, Malashan claims Oracle or Farmer. If Farmer. So once again, I am your chef with the zero. Good beans. Uh, I am the Oracle. That's a double claim. It very well might be. Ah, understood. The other one is a pixie, got it. Hmm. It's a good idea, I Bruce. Oracle, cuckoo, kachu. I believe you. Alright. Well, that's all I got for you at the moment. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. Bye. I'm an idiot, I didn't put this down. What a nice oracle. Very, uh, eye-opening. Eye yes. We had a nice conversation, I think. Hmm. And now I'm left alone again. So all of these places are named after Connecticut places, and it always uh, makes me laugh. Anyway, uh, oh. what would you, <laughs> if you're ever what in you Connecticut, like to do? go yep. to J. Timothy's Tavern. Uh, I'm sorry? If you're ever in Connecticut, go to J. Timothy's Tavern. I was actually at J. Tim's, this is for Demita, I was at J. Tim's two weekends ago because I hadn't been in a long time, and it's so delicious. Oh, it's the best. Uh, the best wings yep. you'll ever have. Yeah, it's all of my friends. So I'm vegetarian, so I have, I have their veggie stuff, but uh, my friends were having all the wings, and they looked a little good. There you I'll go. keep that in mind. Uh, but anyway, cool. Dylan, yeah, what would you like to do? <laughs> Sponsor us, yeah. Uh So, lucky for you, I'm playing a rather open game because I happen to be the Stormcaught Chambermaid. Oh, you know what? I forgot to ask that about that yesterday. Arthur, that didn't trust the person next to me. That wasn't you. Oh. Basically, I've not played with this Stormcourt stuff before, and D Dylan came right out me as that, and I didn't know if that could, like, be a bluff or whatever. Um, and I, if they were, like, something that could poison me i wanted to check but at least you know so i was like some see if you were willing to die to see if that changed my number at all mm -hmm. so i lied to you and did it no <laughs> but i can only push that but i but i can't push the other way because obviously then we're killing the person who's claiming to be storm court um and i can't push the other way because then we're just killing players for no reason so that's like undack i mean like so pretty much i just wanted to I hate being an empath who can't get more information. I fucking hate it. And you know Could that, Tomato. Yeah, if I talk to Dak, okay. can I reveal you, your role? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, if it's if it's beneficial, I don't know what Dak is. I haven't spoken to them yet. I but... have a feeling I know who he is. And okay. if he... he... Oof. Well, if that's the case, let's just keep all the noise on me anyway. All right, that works Thank for me. You. Thank you. Thank you. Why a demon would, or for for my whole farmer thing, if you numb or if you do that and you give a explanation, say that uh, the flower girl died, but there is a pixie out there who is a yep. flower girl. Yep. So that yep. way, I hope I just I just want to die. Yeah. If it's yep. not a widow game, that makes yeah that makes you a target. So. Yeah, should I, I don't know, should I shoot Dakota to close that world that maybe Dakota was the demon who's pretending there's a widow? I think it wouldn't be a demon, it's more likely a minion. 
Okay, yeah, so... Well, so. Uh, yeah, so I'll, I'll either... Sh we can then have you have my seamstress ability towards the end and then, you know, use that as the cannibal. Because you're going with cannibal? Yeah. Uh, Tori's... Yeah, uh, have. I'm... Yeah, I know that. I just... I had to talk to Mac Daddies. Where's Mac um, Daddies? Dakota's evil, correct? Uh, yeah, uh, according to Tori, Dakota was turned evil. Okay. Um, Dakota's also poisoned. Um, so, poisoned, balloonist, evil Dakota. <laughs> evil, poisoned, balloonist. Yeah. Um, here's my thing. Yeah. I'm tempted to fake JR's number, because JR got a zero. Correct. That's true. I'm tempted to fake a one to seem that JR might be poisoned. Okay. Uh, Dylan thinks, and I think we should continue th making him think this, that he may have been the Widow Poison, which would make sense if there's a Widow with a Stormcard player. And the Chambermaid is really uh, evil, Demita. Um, but... Yeah, I, think I'll, I think I'll go with that Chef one to make it seem okay. like possibly Dylan. Sounds <laughs> good. Or... Right. So... Um... I have not checked you, nor have I checked the other outsider claim that I have, uh, but I haven't gotten a chance to talk with the people that I've checked so far, so I'll do that soon. All right, that's fair. Thank you very much. Thank you. Uh, when am I getting dragged? <laughs> Sorry. You were the chef, correct? Yeah. You might be next, but I'm the cannibal. I got a one. Okay, we definitely need to kill Tori tonight. I don't think it's Tori, though. Yes. Oh, this might backfire. Okay. Hodgepodge. Cannibal. Okay. Hodgepodge. All right. What did you get last night? The cannibal. I didn't get anything as the cannibal last night. Okay, that makes sense, I guess. I have I mean, no shame. Haha, -ha, the I mean, dragon th returns. Maybe they do? <laughs> Hello, everybody. Balashad has less shame than I have. Oh, that's <laughs> rough. Uh, that, that's that, interesting. How does do. anyone in this game have any shame left after being on this channel for so long? Hello, everybody. Let's <laughs> do some uh, talking, and then we'll do some noms. Yeah, yeah. Are you really what you claimed yesterday? I am. That's interesting. And have you I revealed that publicly that... yet? Yes, I have. Uh, okay. I am the chef with the zero. Apparently, that might not be true information. Based on what? Based on another person's role. That okay? That yeah, which means I might be. Uh, I'm either drunk or I might be sitting next to an Odashi. Interesting. Okay, mm. is it me or Dak then? I guess we should be told. I don't have a clue. Okay, Dak, are you the Nodashi? <laughs> Dak, are you the Nodashi? No. Oh, then it, it must be. You lie about that, oh. right? No. Not Dakshi. No Dakshi. <laughs> That's pretty good. Okay. Uh, it must be me then, because. Slayer. Oh, sorry. Resnora claims Slayer and shoots Dak. Resnora, what's your weapon of choice? Uh, ooh, a satchel of Richard. Uh, hey. Classic. <laughs> well, um... Jupiter satchel of Richard? Yeah, a, Jupiter sized. A Jupiter sized <laughs> satchel of Richards. Well, Jupiter have you guys ever, you, you guys ever seen, uh, Final Fantasy VII? You know, like how, like, you call Meteor down onto the planet? Um, yes. Aww. In this case, so it sad. is a Jupiter sized satchel of richards that's been summoned by the black materia by rez <laughs> and squarely aimed at the general vicinity of dak and the i keep on thinking of that gif of the the, the raining dildos um it all comes oh, to oh, this is my time to shine <laughs> <laughs> I have that Jeff favorite. I have it favorite. Of course you do. Now. There it is. Okay. So oh, I hate it. They <laughs> land into the upper atmosphere and burn up. There is no effect. Cool. So I think we're going to today. Unfortunately, yeah. was this Slayer and Sh Dakota claims Slayer and shoots Tori. Dakota, what's your weapon of choice? 
uh, 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 love. Aww, Dakota. That sounds so violent. Takes love. Such love, love. <laughs> takes love and loads a it into of love. a satchel of love and loads it into the crossbow. Um, unfortunately, uh, they got the spelling wrong because one of the letters was worn out, and it was actually a satchel of glove. And it was just a oh. big satchel filled with gloves. I so didn't get degloved. Um. Oh. Um. The gloves <laughs> fly directly past Tori and slap Tori in the face. No, they don't. Nothing happens. Yay. So can I know why it's me or Dak? Uh, because Anodashi makes them um, neighbors, whether uh, if they're, uh, so long as they're a townsfolk, okay. maybe an outsider, Sorry. but definitely townsfolk is, uh, is uh, drunk. Or and why is why is your information not trustworthy? Because that's what I'm someone... not sure on. Okay, I'm not going to claim who it is. Uh, tell people uh -huh. who it is, but there is a cannibal uh -huh. in play, and they okay. told me that they got a one. Okay. Do either Malashad or Dylan think that they are also poisoned? Uh, I don't know if there's any information that could be gained from that. I have Wait. no idea. The, I don't know. Uh, cannibal, the cannibal could be. No dashy poisoned. Yeah. No, but also, uh, so they got a one. So what? They're like a empath chef. So, oh, because right, you're saying you're. That means that they're a dead. chef. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Second yeah, yeah, call right. for nominations. Yeah. Which means that my Tori. information is incorrect. Rez Nora nominates Tori. Rez, tell me why. Okay. Um, I don't believe for a second that Dakota is the Slayer because I'm the Slayer. So there's, you know, this. Slayer shot on Tori, I don't think, proves that Tori's uh, not the demon. I think we should just close this world now before we get too carried away with things. Um, and then we could possibly look at who the neighbors um, of the cannibal are. But we have good information that um, either, you know, JR, it sounds like JR was, you know, um, possibly sat next to a Nodashi. So we should, we should just close out that world now. Thank you. Tori, your defense. Um, I'm. I can die if we need someone to die, but I don't see what makes the cannibals' number any more believable than the original chef number. Um, also, would that mean that Dylan can be killed at night? I mean, thing. Anyway, not the point. Uh, <laughs> uh I don't. Kill me if you have to, but I don't see why we're trusting anything above anything else, especially because I'm still a role that can get information. We would need five for this to pass. Information that has only supported JR's information so far, I should add. Alright, fucking rip me, I guess. <laughs> I got you, JR. Six is enough. Tori is on the block. Any other nominations today? So if we kill me, is the kind of like, and I and the game doesn't end. If you are what the hell? The so if you are the sober empath. Yeah. Thanks. Okay. Sorry. For Ooh. example. <laughs> then, Love it. Thanks for then, that. Sorry. Then the cannibal will receive that information. If you are not, they will receive other information. If they're really a cannibal. Gonna end the yeah. day in five, four, three. And that's if I've outed your role, that is. Two. We'll see. One. Tori, town has chosen to execute you. What's your preferred method of death? I guess uh, being killed as a single player when the prevailing narrative is that there are two evil players sat next to each other, then that can't possibly be me. Is that a is that a form Figure of that out. Okay. Uh, let's I guess see. so. Um, the town recruits an out of town chef to come in and cook <laughs> a meal specifically for Tori. Hmm. It is laced with delicious. Bullshit. I was going to say delicious vegan treats, but all right, sure. Bullshit. Let's go with that. <laughs> um, Tori enjoys the meal ingests it as regularly as a satchel of Richards for whoever Rez was aiming at, I don't remember, 
Um, Dak. Dak. Um, except they burned up in the atmosphere. Uh, it was a delicious meal. Unfortunately, uh, Town basically told Tori, hey, this is the way that you're going to die. And uh, Tori was like, yeah, fine, it's fine. At least it's delicious. And uh, Tori is executed and does not survive. Everybody will go to sleep. But first, I will tell you that Awaken the Bear... Awaken the Bear. Sounds like a great metal album. Unfortunately, it's not a metal album. It is a magic card. Sorry, guys. Oh, uh, again. You Top guys tier. all went with mail, or you guys all went with uh, metal with metal album. So congratulations. Yeah, I did say it's probably a green card, but it sounds like a great metal. It, it sounds really metal. Your next one is elect the dead. Everybody go to sleep. Ah, yes. Oh, Vampire Giant. Oh, you're killing me, dude. That was such a good idea. I feel bad I didn't get that now. I just say I just took off a year of your life. <laughs> um This this they got a I think they need to move the poison around. I think like honestly, yeah, Jose maybe. might want to kill themselves. Yeah, I mean, that's an option for them, but it does mean that that's two evil players dead. No, that true. is a pretty big sacrifice. Yeah. Uh, okay, so who's first? There's a lot of dead people. Um, Jose first? God, it's Jose first. Wow. Okay. Please choose a player. Oh, goodness. I was told the flower girl was sitting next to me in poison, but that doesn't seem right now. Um, so I'm hunting for that flower girl. I don't know where they are. Um, let's go for skills. Okay. Thank you very much. Hey, Jose. Yes. Do you want to know something? Please. The barber has died. Oh. Okay, skills is the barber. Oh my god, sorry, I got confused for a millisecond right there. Um, oh shoot, do I want to do anything? Um, do I want if I bring the Mesephiles back, do they get any word? Uh, yes. However, please note that there is a spirit of ivory on oh, this script. Therefore, it will actually be able to turn anybody. Do you, okay. Do you yeah. want me to come back to you? Yeah. Let me think about it just a second. Yeah. Please. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. Awesome. Let's go up top, maybe. Okay. You know what the play is, right? Uh, Well, yeah. To to make the chambermaid go out of, of play, you swap the chambermaid with anybody who's dead. Quite frankly, I don't know Dylan very well, so I don't know if Dylan is a player who would simply turn themselves evil, but uh, right, I just said it. Spirit of Ivory can't happen. I'm so sad about that. Yeah. Uh, but you swap the chambermaid with somebody dead. You have to pick Dylan as one of the players. You could either turn the chamber... You can get an evil chambermaid who is safe. Or you can right. swap it out with a dead player and just turn Dylan into something that's already dead. Yeah. Um, yep. Uh, uh, so Jose does know that Dylan is the chambermaid, but it might be that he just hasn't realized that that is a uh, play quite yet. Um, you know, keep in mind that uh, the players are under a bit of pressure, especially demons, right? Like your your brain on demonhood is just not the same as your brain not on demonhood. You lose like 20 IQ points when you're a demon. <laughs> yeah, you really, really do. Because if you've never played this game, I'm telling you, you absolutely lose like 20 IQ points whenever you become... Uh, yeah, it's uh, there's just so much pressure on you that like when you're put on the spot for something like a barber swap, and you don't have the full grim and et cetera, et cetera, right? You're sat there going like, I don't know what the fuck to do. So what I'm, what we're saying basically is that if a suboptimal choice is made, uh, don't be surprised. Uh, it is pretty common that in that case, a barber swap usually is a huge yeah. surprise to the demon. So yeah, it usually is. Um, Fraser, why Tori didn't turn Dylan on day one is because Tori turned Dakota, a guaranteed player who will absolutely say the word, whom Tori has already an established relationship with. 
Um, I, Dylan is a little bit newer to our server and we welcome him. He is a lovely presence here, um, but I think Tori doesn't just know Dylan well enough to know whether that is a player to turn. And again, already has a pretty established rapport with Dakota. Yeah. Mesopheles do tend to turn people that they already have a good relationship with, you know? Well, let's see if Jose's made up their mind. All right, we're back. You got anything? Uh, um, I ran through a couple of things, and I think anything that I do confirms good players, and that is the last thing that I want to do. Um, I'm sure there's something cool that I can do here, but I don't see it, other than like switching myself with Kale, which is basically the same thing. Um, yeah, I'm not going to use it. Okay. Thank you. Thank you. It happens, chat. This is a thing that happens. Yep, sometimes you just don't see the play that's there. Um, I mean, it just means that they have to push on Dylan as evil, which Tori Bluffing Empath was already sort of working on. Um, yeah, uh, but yeah, I think the Chambermaid's going to be uh, possibly a sticking point for them. Um, in the chats that I have heard Dylan in, uh, I know that I'm the storyteller, and I know that Dylan's good, so take this with a grain of salt, because of course that could be influencing... But I think he reads as very good to most players yes. that he's been chatting with. So I think they might have some struggle with pushing Dylan as evil. Uh, Farmer doesn't go tonight. We go to Ryback next. Please choose a player. Bruce. You choose a Bruce. Thank you very much. And we go to that person next. We go to that person next. Please. Oh, right. I have to do the thing. I was going to the wrong person. <laughs> don't, no, no, don't, don't, don't do that. That's I, rude. I, I don't, I don't want to uh, pick a player. I mean, you could pick a player if you like. I'm just not bubbling tonight. Sorry. <laughs> Still stuck in in the previous game mode. Yeah, I think Demet is. I'm always stuck in another game mode. Um. Navian, do you have this number handy? Because I went to the wrong player. Uh, we should maybe just finish out the night and come back to deck. Yeah, I'm sorry. I came to you in the wrong order, deck. I apologize. That's yeah, fine. we got to make sure we're doing certain things in certain orders. Token so we'll be back. Don't worry. That's good. <laughs> I went in. I went in half cocked. I just went in half cocked. And I was like, oh, shit. What do we tell him? <laughs> So basically, there are definitely some people who think that Tori is evil, um, and yeah, so I think showing a zero here could be interesting. And then probably showing a one tomorrow, because even if they kill another evil player, it's still the wrong number. Yeah. Uh, okay, so I did. do you feel like we have wasted enough time to simulate going to a different player? Uh, yeah, I think that's fine. All right. Sorry about that, man. That's all right. Uh, listen, it's 11 o'clock. You know, I'm still, you know. Uh, you wake up and you get a zero. Okay. Thank you very much. Yep. Uh, where is that person? Hello. Good morning. Uh, it's still evening. Ah, uh, it's morning for me. What's up? Uh, I am going to wake you up and I am going to show you... Ryback. Ooh. I'm pretty sure I'm just no dash sheet, though. So that's fun. Maybe. 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 Okay, bye. Please choose two players. Uh, I will. Uh, may I please choose Skills and Resnora? You choose Skills and Resnora, and you get a zero. Thank you very much. Thank you. This chambermaid's adding up. Uh, did. Did they just say skills because skills is dead? Mm. 
That is an illegal choice. Please choose again. Oh. Again. Okay. Uh, in that case, can I choose skills and DAC, please? That is an illegal choice. Please choose again. It, that is an illegal choice. Uh, Resnora and DAC, please. Resnora and DAC, you get a... One. Thank you. Yep. I hate the chambermaid. It's okay. I deserve this. Chambermaid did nothing wrong. I know, but like they. Wow. Okay. Uh. So in chat, Buttspot has just said. Me, uh, so my original message is me. I'll pay better attention. Also, me spaces out as soon as we enter Chambermaid's cabin. And Buttspot has said, Me, but, but, bet, but, attention. Nice. But, Buttspot really doing the Lord's work today. Um, there have been no farmers, no farmer deaths yet. Yeah, there has not been. And um, if that demon jump happens before Bruce dies, then there never will be. That's a good point. Yikes. Okay. All right. Thank you. I will head back to town. Good morning, my lovely humans. Uh, most of you knew this one. Elect the Dead was by System of a Down Front Man, Serge Tankian. And it was an album. I thought that sounded familiar. Your next one is... I have this one on paper. I'm sorry. That's why you hear the ruffling. Discouraged Ones. Is Discouraged Ones an album or a magic card? Uh, also, Skills died last night. Shocking. Ah, that's bad. Noms. Were you, anybody... were you what you told me, Skills? Six minutes. Maybe. Uh, Demeda, game chat is frozen for Twitch. Does anyone want to speak to Dakota? Uh, uh, you, to chat? you claim to me skills? Yeah, let's go, Jose. Uh, yeah, about... JR, that is correct claim for you. Speak. Skills, well, do you but... still want to have that conversation? Yeah, Dylan, let's talk. Okay. Dakota, speak. Wait. Does someone want to talk to me? Kale. Let's go, Kale. Dak, can I chat with you? Me? I'm going to guess you might be the cannibal. I am not. I am not the cannibal. Seamstress, then? I am the seamstress, yep. Okay. Yeah, yeah you gave me seamstress, farmer, and cannibal, so, okay. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah. I forgot that I put in the farmer. I, I, didn't, I didn't believe farmer, but... I, I, anytime, like... yeah, anybody gives me farmer, I just didn't even put it in there. Yep. Um, actually, actually, you gave me farmer, farmer, too. That's funny, so. didn't you? Yep, I did give you farmer as well, yeah. Do you mind sharing what I'm you were? What, what are you? Yeah, I was the, fl I was the flower girl. Oh, I no! Oh, really. oh, shoot. Okay. I was you gotta give me something so I know that you're not a minion, or at least so I can go to the other person and get their hard claim and make sure you guys aren't double claiming each other. Uh, I will tell you I am not a minion. And that I receive information in the night. How's that? <sighs> Come on. I really want to trust you. You were 20 years old when that album came out. Shades here. Well, so the problem no, though sure. is that like, I mean, I'm I... not showing the satchel or Richards at your face. But look, now, now, somebody said they thought they might be no, no dashy poisoned, and we had reason to believe that there was a widow in play at the time. In which... so, all right, that's all I had. Thank you for the information, uh, Chad. If you want to recap, um, it's very simple. Um, I asked if Dylan had card claimed to Tori their role. They said yes. Um, I didn't verify that I am the barber, which means we're not in a Fangu world because otherwise I would still be alive. Um, so, yay, not a Fangu. Yep. Uh, and I uh, sort of spat it out about a theory that uh, Tori, uh, according to my information, is probably the Mizahos. And I am in wholehearted agreement, and I think that Dakota is probably evil also. Yep. Cool. All right. Thank you. All right, thank you. See ya. Uh, okay. You might be in a double claim. Yeah, I know. I've heard I'm in a double claim. I'm evil. I I don't know what to do, Bruce. 
I'm just a barber. That's all I am. Okay, Doki. All right. <laughs> Bye, Bruce. Thank you. Okay, that's what I believe it to be. Like, that's one of the worst deaths for town, I think, at this stage. Yeah, it's not great. I mean, well, it depends what it is. I haven't heard of any swaps, so it probably means either no swap or evil swap. So we just have to. We've, we've got that coin flip now of did the demon move. Right. Especially after a um, flower girl truck. Yep. Well, yep. What do you want to know, so, Malachan? I kind of want to know what you really are because you've made like three different claims to me and none of them <laughs> make sense. <laughs> I want to die, but that's just, that's up to that's up to you. I've done my job. Hmm. Or I'm doing my job. Okay. I have reasons for I have reasons for doing the things I'm doing. When we find out what the demon is, I may be a little bit more open. The hell was 2007? That's impossible. Okay, I get you. Yeah, I think I get you. Cool. Future. Thank you. I'm the God, I'm the farmer. Okay, I was the barber, so we might have had a swap last night. Um, Dakota hard acclaimed farmer to me just or barber to me just now. Yeah, Dakota is evil. Yeah. Yeah, because originally they hard claimed Klutz, and then when I told them that I was the Klutz, knowing full well that they probably weren't, um, they switched to Barber, and I know that's a lie. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I wasn't sure what to do. I feel like it would it would have confirmed anything that I did, so I just didn't use it. Yeah. He's lying, saying he's Pixie Slayer, but he's not. He's the Barber. Okay. Any um... idea the Barber might be? I think it might be right back. I'm going to talk to some people. I'm going to go talk to Dak specifically soon. Okay. I think he's the Oracle. I'm going to talk to Dak, see what I can get out of them, and then we'll go from there. Well, I'm either one of drunk. those two or I'm the drunk, so. That's fair. All right. Sounds good. Thank you. Thank you. Yep. Bye. Or I'm just the Oracle. And okay. I would really love to know what your thoughts are on our demon. I'm trying to figure out what it is at this point. That's like, what I would really like to know. I've heard... Oh, and and do we also think that someone has used Hodge Lodge somewhere? Hodgepodge. Oh, you just said the Mez word, didn't you? I did not. <sighs> there's a there's a reason to my math. There's a method to my madness. Okay. Okay. I have I have no idea what the demon is at this point, except for the fact that it might be a Fangu. I'm not sure. Then I am definitely the Oracle. And this was a hodgepodge of thoughts. Oh, Jesus. Oh, my God. Okay. Okay. This is, this is by far the strangest clock tower conversation I have had in quite some time. And I have never heard anyone say that particular word. Or You've phrase. never heard of hodgepodge before? Not as much as you've just said it. Oh, I've heard of it, but I've never heard anyone say it as much as you've just said it. Put me in the ground, please. <laughs> I am like, now I'm wondering if you're the Mez and like you're trying to get me to say the word like on the DL and I just... What? I All will be revealed once we have an idea of what the demon is. I'm an idiot. Okay. I'm... Oh no. Wrong one. I know how to use commands, guys. Wrong one? Yeah, I used the wrong command. <laughs> oh, go ahead. No, I didn't. Oh, rude. You made it. You muted. You muted, Demita. Go ahead, guys. Go ahead. Yep, get it. Technical difficulties. Demita. Mark it down. Mark it on your, yep. just... Mark it on yeah, your bingo card, okay. guys. Congratulations. Uh, anyway, okay. uh, we're back to town. Uh, let's do the thing. So, heads up for anybody does open. anything. Uh, um, sorry, Bruce. That's fine. Um, I was the barber. We do not have a Fangu game. 
And you, it's you're still the barber, right? You didn't, you didn't. Still, change. still the barber. I have not been switched, so that means that if they did do a switch, it was somebody else. Oh, yep. good. Um, Within the Evo team, probably. Our yeah, nomination's yeah. open. Because Rez is going to be awfully confused. I am the butler. Yeah, um, I'd like that, to kill Ryback today, then. Please. Well, so, so, hold on. So then we have three outsiders because I'm the klutz. Uh, okay. Oh no. Hey, yeah, what? Dakota's evil. <laughs> oh, uh, Bruce no. nominates Dakota. Yeah. Nominations aren't open. There might but, be another uh, reason. Okay. Hey, hold it. Do we have a blueness though? I've got. I've, there's still potential for a blueness in the claims I've got. I also do there's want to point out we do. We do have a Sarah notice. Yeah. Sorry. We do have a Sarah as well. Yes. Sorry. 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 Uh, also, Dakota had claimed something else to somebody else earlier and didn't get executed, so probably not a. Uh... Bruce has Fair nominated enough. Dakota. Why? Dakota starts off the game with the um, whole seeing a widow, and then they walked it back, and then they hard claimed somebody else's role, and then they walked it back again, and then. Um, and the fact that there's this whole flower girl piece of information that kind of suggests something there. So I I, I think Dakota is out at evil and if we get rid of Dakota that gets rid of a consistent evil vote as well. How do you feel Dakota? Uh, I feel like I already did my job and one of you are now evil. So have fun. Bye bye now. <laughs> Yo, mm -hmm. we would road, I got gotcha. you. We would need four for this to pass. Can I ask, uh, so apparently there's a cannibal around. Did they have a nice meal? The cannibal doesn't have to answer, I'm just wondering if any but Basically, my notion was that I died so that we could see if they had sort of, if their information was sus or if the original chef, chef info was sus. So I'm just trying to get a read on whether that's actually born fruit. Hmm. Uh, um, I actually five. have... Okay, Dakota's on the I'll phone. keep this for myself for now. Okay. Uh, I, Malishan. I think, we'll make, I, I, think I know who the demon is as all. Well. Malishan? Nope. Yes, the demon is Malishan. How can you tell? No, <laughs> no, I, Malishan is talking in chat, saying that oh. they've been trying to talk, and every time they've tried to talk, there's been a nomination, so I'd like Malishan to have the floor. Yeah, yeah so what I was explaining when that nomination happened was that I've got a, a, like a soft blueness claim out there from a couple of places potentially. So if we have a blueness and a, you know, any, de it's, we know it's not a Fangu if it gets skills, it's telling the truth. But if we've got a blueness and an imp or a little monster or an Odashi, we should have three outsiders. So we, you know, we have three outsiders right now. So we, we shouldn't just jump on the third outsider as necessarily being evil because of that. Um, and um, if skills is right and there isn't a Fangu, because they would have become the Fangu last night. Or whatever, or you know what I mean. Um, then, yeah, I basically just one plus one to Malishan stuff. If we're not worried about a Fengu jumping to an outsider, then I don't see what the issue is with our outsiders currently, except for incredibly dodgy social reads on behalf of Dakota. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I do have suspicion of Dakota, so I don't think it's the worst kill. No. Oh yeah, I'm just saying. Like, Second we keep right back alive. Is is the is the out is the outcome there? So right. Dakota, yeah. can you clarify? Oh, I'm so sorry. Sorry. No, I was just gonna say. So the question that I asked before, the cannibal with a different chef number sort of stuff, is that um, did that actually come to fruition, or am I dead for no reason? I mean, I I haven't heard from a cannibal, but either way, I think a a big part of the reason why you were executed was to close off the worldview that JR was sat next to an Odashi. Final call for nominations. But JR's <laughs> asking about this. Yeah, for anyone who doesn't know, I was the flower girl. I was killed night one, so I got no info. If there oh. was a... Yeah, so... Uh, I, I, have... I don't know why JR wants me to say that, but... Sorry. I have heard of um, a, a pixie that is now the flower girl, though, so... I heard right. that and they've in pulled that... it back, I think, but it's still true, possibly. So. Oh, sorry, in that case, can we kill Dak? Because we're still trying to confirm whether that chef info is right. We killed one of JR's neighbors, but not the other, who won't talk uh, to me. I, so. I, I, I would rather kill. I, I would rather kill out an evil like Dakota, who said that they turned someone. 
Yeah. Okay. That's true. It's well, it's, it's Dakota. I don't because you're going to kill me anyways. What, what do you want from me, Skills? Three. Dakota, I'm sorry that I have rented space inside your head. Two. <laughs> you have no space on my head. None space for you. Dakota, Wait, by the way. Just the klutz. You have been chosen to be executed. What is your preferred method of death? Um, well, making a klutz pick, uh, I haven't died yet, so I'll do it when when you're done. I'm going to narrate your death, like, AF. So please give me All right, a cool, method cool. of execution. Uh, death I, AF? Uh, Join me. Joining dead. me. Yeah, joining Tori in the afterlife. Okay. That's um, how I die. Well, much like... A mother who can't bear to see their child dead before them. Uh, Town says, hey, do you want to die? And Dakota's like, bet, fam. And Town's like, yeah, let's do that. Uh, Dakota is executed and dies. And congratulations. Dakota claims klutz. There's a, there's a klutz claim, everybody. And choose his Resnora. I just want to confirm you're choosing Resnora. Yes. Okay, cool. Everybody go to sleep. Oh, hey. wait, 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 oh. wait, 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 wait. Uh, nope, I already did that one. What's, what's this one? Oh, right. Discouraged Ones was by Catatonia. No, again, that's me. Excellent band. Highly recommended. Your next one is Victory. Victory. Everybody go to sleep. That's us. What do you know about Catatonia? Hell yeah, I love Catatonia. Where, what do you know about them? Like, where are they from? Uh, that's a good question. I actually don't know where they're from. I have a tendency to not know where bands are from. I just know <laughs> the, the music. music. Is good. Well, I'm glad the music's good then. Uh, okay. So they have two dead. We probably are not going to tell Dak that there's two dead. No, at this point, I think we give him a one. We have to give a one, right? Yeah. Uh, okay. Everything else is kind of through the motions right now. Um, Jose really can't kill Bruce. If we, yeah, Jose can't kill Bruce here, right? Like, there's no way that works. Oh, God. Um, if, wait, if Bruce, if Jose jumps, the chambermaid is poisoned. No, never mind. No. No, no Alishan's poisoned. Never mind. Yeah. I'm an idiot. Um, I'm thinking. Yeah, of, I mean. Okay. If if Bruce is killed, then we have to think about who we who we change into the farmer. I think it's not Dylan. Everybody already believes Dylan is good. Uh, I guess we could move it to Rez or Ryback. I mean, we, we could also put it on Dak. I was going to say, um, yeah, we could just give it to Dak. Yeah, Dak's already got some, some poisoned Oracle info. Um, yeah, it's it's really hard to say. I mean, farmer is an incredibly strong role, right? Uh, so, right. yes, our res would currently kill the farmer chain. Um, and in fact, let's see how many players alive. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven alive. Yeah, there'd be very little chance for for that farmer or for the uh, Scarlet Woman jump to happen after uh, after this death in the night. This is rough. Yeah, um, but we'll see. I mean, it's, it skills is already onto the world of Jose, but if they execute Jose tomorrow, then Kale can still become the demon. I don't know if anybody's on to Kale yet. I don't think they are, but once they realize that that cannibal claim is not going, it's going to look a little sus. Yeah, possibly. But yep, well, let's go see what Jose wants to do. Please choose a player. Oh gosh, I've been debating the whole time. Um, I really don't want to create a farmer chain. I hate the farmer. Let's. Um, 
let's go with Bruce. I'm not sure what they are. I hope they're the farmer. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right. So chat. I think the amount of times you hear a demon being like, I hope this isn't the Raven Keeper. I hope they're not the sage. I hope it's not the farmer. And then that's exactly what they what they uh -huh. hit. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, Dak has not been given zeros thus far. Dak has gotten ones. Um, that got zero, zero, one. Yeah, it was zero, or, well, zero. we'll be, we'll be getting a one tonight. Yeah. Uh, except that they are not. I think we might actually be better off turning them into the... We might be better off actually turning them into the farmer. The farmer, yeah. And then that way Dak can't substantiate anything with regards to Dakota or who died tonight. Well, Dak will know that the farmer died tonight, obviously. Yeah. I think that's the play. I think we turn Dak to the farmer. All right. Let's go for it. All right. Hey, Dak. Hello. You are now the farmer. Okay. Thank you. All right. So we now have to do the butler and that's it no chambermaid butler and chambermaid butler and chambermaid yes right, cool where is that person every day i'm butling uh bruce again butling 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 no, nothing. Okay, fine. Bruce, sorry, Bruce again. No, I know, I know. I just was singing. Um, and I was, I was trying to do you a favor. <laughs> oh, brutal! I got to kill somebody in this game. That's true, and my, I am now slain. What a Thank savage! You. Thank you, my. Please choose two players. Uh, may I please choose uh, Dak and Jose? Dak. And Jose. I. I actually need a rules clarification, Navian. Uh, sure, we can go into a private channel. Thank you, Nate W, for the bit. Um,. Did Dak wake up to their own ability? Um, no. I would say that they woke up because the game rules specify that you need to wake characters in order to tell them of a character change. But it was their ability that woke it up. Um, yeah. I mean, it's, it's a gray area, in my opinion. Um, similarly, people do rule goon, kind of, like, when they wake up for their alignment change, uh, whether you should take that for a chambermaid or not. The, um, even though it's a game rule that players know their alignment and you must inform them of any change. Uh, there's a, a note in the almanac um, about how the, the chambermaid selects the goon and something or other uh, and they receive a one because uh, they're drunk or something like that um, instead of what their right number should have been. I don't know. There's just something in the almanac that implies that waking up when your own ability is what's causing things like a character change or an alignment change, then it does count as waking up. Um, May I read you an entry from expansion info from Ed? Uh, sure. If a chambermaid selects a player that started the night as another non-waking or post-transformation waking character and has become the farmer during the night and therefore has been woken to be told this, they're not waking due to their ability. They're waking because their character has been changed and they need to be told. If they, wo if they right. woke due to their previous ability prior to becoming a farmer, however, they would register as a one, but they didn't, so it's a Yeah, one. so that basically tracks with what I was saying. Okay, thank you, Fraser. And thank you, But Nadia. yeah, I, 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 would, I would be okay if a storyteller ever ruled it a different way for um, the same reason that, you know, yeah, as long as it's clear, but also for the same reason that Goon ticks up, even though it kind of sounds like maybe it shouldn't. Right. Um, because you could argue that, like, Dak is waking to his own ability because he is now the farmer and was uh, wasn't before. It, yeah. 
Um, you could also rule Dak's not waking to his own ability because Bruce is the farmer who originated it, Correct. right? There's different ways that you could rule this as a gray area. Uh, let's find out, or let's give the info. I'm sorry about that. I needed to sit with Navian for a second. Uh, you get a one. Thank you. Yep. All right. So that's everything. So they're going down to six. They have one more chance to Scarlet Woman. They do, yeah. This is, uh, and I think there's going to be a pretty big push on Jose today. I think you're right. So then if that happens, then the Nodashi poison affects nobody. Right. Dylan would be proven. Rez would not. Um, Jose is bluffing cannibal. Interesting. Um, I'm not sure who's bluffing Seamstress Mullabach. Uh, maybe Kale? Yeah, Kale is proving, is, uh, is claiming cannibal. No, Jose's been claiming cannibal, as far as I know. Oh, I thought Kale was proving cannibal. Uh, Kale would be uh, Seamstress then, I believe. Because I think yeah, okay. took Empire. Well, <laughs> Kale, Cannibal, Jose. Okay, I'm the one who's got it backwards then. Everybody else is correcting me. Cool. All right, well, let's, uh, let's head back. Dog facts? Is that a thing? What? What? Oh, I want to use that now. Okay, anyway. Um, we have a command for dog facts. Not cat facts. Well, that's clearly wrong. Hello, everybody. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Uh, a person died last night, and that person is my spirit. Um, L. Uh, also, Aww. also Bruce. Oh, you, you can't <laughs> die again. Um, no, I said my spirit died. I know. I can't die again. That's interesting. That is interesting. Oh, Tori. Okay, oh, can, yeah. I'm sorry. No, Dak, can we talk? Uh, I'd like to speak to Bruce first. Jose, Dak, okay. To uh, I follow to you, Cal. Dak, you said you wanted to talk to me. Oh, that's. Uh, okay. Oh, I... Sorry, who said that? Emelishan. Oh, uh, yeah. We can go ahead and talk. Can I join in that, guys? You're already gone. I've got to say, it's cannibal, real quiet. Got to know, yeah, yeah, because she's pretty much confirmed, isn't she? Most people trust Rise Nora. Yeah, so I, I am thinking we need to get Dylan out of here because if he's trusted, then then we're screwed. We need to get Dylan. Um, so Dylan, Rez, no, um, and then I'm gonna say to get me executed so that he can go to the cannibal, and that's what we're talking about right now. You might want to tell somebody. I am terribly Rez Nora. I might go talk to people. Well, does it make sense? Because if I got a no on them, I don't want to talk to either one of them, right? You might want to you might want to tell some other live player. The chambermaid and said you woke up what you lied to me and that was what I was hoping you would do. But I yeah, died. yeah, I had sort of penned you down as the farmer at that point, so I was just kind of I was originally gonna try and bounce you off a couple of people, but then you were dead. So yep. yeah, so um... I was hoping you would I was hoping you'd prove yourself by telling me I'd lied, but I died before you could do that. So yeah. Uh, so, uh, what, do you want me to just go ahead and walk through my information real quick to see if to it... Yeah. Okay, so I've got four nights of information. My first night of information was Tori and Dakota, and I got a two. Uh, second night of information was Tori and Dak. I got a one. Uh, third night was Nora right. and Dak. I also got a one, which makes sense if Reznor is the Slayer. Uh, last night, I picked Jose and Dak, and I got a one. So... Uh, mate, that all makes sense. Was it Tori? What was the first night? So Tori the first and... night was Tori and Dakota, and I got a two. That's the one that doesn't make sense to me. Yeah, that's the one that feels a bit weird, uh, unless... Unless Dakota's being truthful and she yeah, Mazepheles yeah, she... turned someone, that would make sense if Tori okay, yeah. then was the Saranobos. But, or um, 
or was the demon and we have a scarlet woman potentially in play or Tori was just the empath and that was pretty like but yeah dakota being the yeah Tori being what she anything Tori could be i think to make sense if dakota was the mez which uh Tori doesn't line up with being the empath because I uh, checked. Two, yeah. yeah, I checked her Maybe with Dak and I got a one, and I also got a one off of Dak and Resnor. Okay. Which, uh, yeah, that Dak might just be the demon here. Um, yeah, I'm thinking either demon or Seranovas potentially. Possibility because they're drunk, so. Exactly. Good stuff. Okay. I'm gonna All try. Right. I'm gonna grab skills real quick. Yeah, sounds Thank good. You. Thank you. Chance that they might be the Oracle, and if I. Cool. Yeah. <laughs> uh, it's all coming together. All right, so we're we're down we're down to Jose and Kale. Yes. We're, we're just not sure which one, but we have time. We have multiple executions. Yep. Yeah. Uh, um, I, I trust. I mean, I haven't talked to Dylan, but people seem to trust Dylan. Um, Skills believes Dylan is Stormcaught. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That... My back. Should have dealt with the Stormcaught a while. Ago. I have a different name other than that, but Ryback's also a good kill because they're it. claiming Butler. It's and it's good to get the Butler out of the way. No, I thought Bruce was claiming Butler. Yeah, it Wait, sucks Bruce for is? evil when there's a Stormcaught character. No, I thought last time Bruce said he was Butler. What was that Ryback and I just misheard? Uh, I believe we can go back to town and ask and double check. Mm. Okay, um... Um, for now, I've got Ryback down as Oracle and Bruce Three, down as Butler. Dak marked as Oracle. I have Dak marked as absolutely nothing because he keeps going back on everything he says. Dak is basically refusing to proclaim, which I'm fine with. It's gotta be, it's gotta be Kale, huh? Gotta be Kale. It's gotta be Christ. Kale. Please Let's kill Kale. Hydrated. Cool. Cool. Thank you. Kill the miner. I mean, what? Kill the miner. <laughs> Definitely, definitely not saying that for Chad's benefit. This is no. going on YouTube, nope. guys. You're going to get demonetized before you get money. Yep. No! <laughs> Thanks a lot. Never. Thanks, Rez. <laughs> Sorry. Bye. Me. I think we're getting dragged. Drag on. You didn't get dragged. Hold on. Uh, the dragon. We already did. Yeah. <laughs> never, never underestimate a dragon. the dragon. Um, I'm gonna open up conversation for like 30 seconds. I'm gonna open up nominations. Can I get the floor for like a second? Yes. Sure. Um, so I wanted to share with Tan my information. I think uh, most people probably already know what I am. I'm this seamstress, and I finally used my ability last night. Um, I'm curious to know. I know it's kind of late. If I feed my seamstress ability to the cannibal do you guys think that's worth it no 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 there are two better kills okay yeah. i think i think i agree it's a, it's a okay. good thought but i think i agree sure sure okay Chat's talking i think, about I think we need the kills more than the info yeah but okay. if you're yeah. willing to give us your information that'd be cool sure yeah so i i got a no between dylan and ryback um dylan 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 and right yeah that tracks okay um, no, no, it really doesn't, Jr. No, it doesn't, yeah. Jr. No, it doesn't. Dak Nom nominates okay. Kale. Dak nominates Kale. Why? Kale is evil. He's either the demon or a minion. Uh, Kale, what's your defense? Uh, huh? I am and the cannibal. That was really close I'm to my honk one. sound. <laughs> honk. <laughs> 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 Anyways, uh, I'm very confused on how I am evil. We would need. I may be poisoned, but three for this to evil. pass. Kale, hard claiming, confused goose. Huh? What's the information Wait. here? I've, I haven't heard a single thing. I, I will spend my dead vote here, guys. We we literally have it down yeah. to Jose. You may get Kale. info out. Yeah. That's. Uh, info, so I don't just... know. Why? I think it's the thing. The thing is. 
Can we just have people try to talk one at a time, please? Everybody, take a second, take a step back. And let's try to uh, do this more orderly. Thank you. Um, skills, why were you confident enough to spend your dead vote on that? I just haven't spoken to a lot of people this game. Okay, this, you, it's going to require me to out people's earls, and, and I don't know I'm if you're okay with that. Oh, I can't. I'm good that with call, that. Skills. So. I'm good with that. Fine with me. Okay, so here's the breakdown. Res is a spent slayer. I'm the barber. Bruce was the farmer who last night got killed. Dak is now the farmer, which confirms that Dak is good. Ryback's voting pattern as a butler makes sense to me. I have nothing from Kale. Malachan, if to be believed, was the starting flower girl. JR is a chef with a zero. Tori, you're claiming empath. However, I don't believe that. I think you're probably the mez who turned Dakota. Dylan, you're the chambermaid who is storm caught. I tend to believe that. You read as good to me. Jose, you claimed cannibal or seamstress, which also happens to be the same two roles that Kale has claimed to other people. So therefore, I think you're both on the evil team together. I'm okay with killing either one of these as long as we kill the other tomorrow. Okay, I'm done. Thank you for talking, and thank you for coming to my TED Talk. <laughs> I'm giving you a round of applause. That was amazing. <laughs> I am oh, yeah. also. Your entire theory is wrong. I mean, and now Kale, I'm going to have to did... do a clock claim. What were Kale, your words of you were... Final call oh, for uh, I would also like to double down on uh, Skills' info. Um, I checked uh, Jose and Dak last night, and I got a one, which would be inconsistent with Jose's seamstress claim. Gonna end the day so? in five. Uh, because... Yeah, if, if, Can I ask if, a storyteller if, question on that? Sorry, yeah. if, if Dak is the farmer, he wouldn't have woken. Sorry, right. Sean. I'm sorry, there was a storyteller question? Yeah, kind of what Toy was saying. If somebody turns into the farmer... Um, would they be considered to have woken tonight due to their ability when they are woken to be told you are now the farmer? If they had previous, there, if they had previously woken up to the thing that they were before they were the farmer, yes. If they had not, the and they became the farmer without having woken up previously, then no. That is not a wake up due to your ability. That is waking up due to, due to a character change. My, I, can I say that my oh, previous, so in this worldview. So Wait, hold Dak on. is Guys, trying no. to say something. No, that's okay. Go yes. ahead. I say what you're gonna say, Doc. My previous, my previous role goes after the farmer. I was the oracle. The one is correct. So, so the, like that, the, if 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 skills is worldview is to be believed, then Jose either has to be what he claimed to be, right, or he's just the imp, and. At that point, why just not kill Jose? I mean, my question here, Jose, was end the uh, day in five. Kale nominates Jose. Your whole Kale nominates Jose. Why? Uh, since I am the cannibal, and apparently Dakota last claimed Klutz, and I got told nothing last night, not even woken up. Um, I don't want to die right now because I'm gonna have to make Klutz fake. Uh, Jose, what's your defense? I, I was willing to die. I'm a spend seam stress. I really believed in this cannibal. I, I don't know anymore what the cannibal the situation is. Um, so it's up to town. Okay. We would need three for this to pass. Sorry, three to tie, four to pass. Either way, it's a dead off the board, but I think Kale's good here. Just go ahead and kill him. Yeah. Of course you think I'm a good kill skills. I That's true. You can. I have information either, to prove it this time. One is not. Kale, you can either choose Resnica, who is the first class. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have. I'm gonna. Or Dak, who is confirmed good. At five, four, three, two, one. Kale, first, how would you like to be executed? Um, put me in a dark maze with nothing but only a candle that is slowly burning out. Hmm. I've played that Mario Party game. Um, That's not even what I'm referencing. I know. Um, we put you in a maze. We give you the candle. Unfortunately, the sage is not on this script, so the candle just disappears. You don't actually have one. So it's just a dark maze. Uh, turns out, being in a dark maze just kind of sucks. Normally, if you had the candle, this execution would take a couple days. But because it's a dark one, uh, you trip and fall in the dark maze, and you die. Hit your head. Whack. Uh, Kale would like to claim Klutz and pick Dak. Kale has claimed Klutz and picked Dak. Yeah. 
I can tell you that there is no magic card named Victory, but man, there are a lot of metal albums called Victory. I'm just going to go with the one from <laughs> Running Wild. Uh, and with that, I'd like to congratulate Town because you guys get one more of our amazing game. Your next one is Blood Feud. Everybody go to bed. Uh, there's there's no way Evil's going to win this. I don't think so. Yeah, it sucks. Um, nerf skills? Hashtag nerf skills? Yeah, I, he's not going to be deterred from this world where Kale and Jose are evil together. I, I don't think so. I just don't see a way. Um, yep. But we'll give it a shot. They, what they really needed was to push much harder on Dylan much earlier in the game, or um, I mean, you know, the, yeah. the barber swap unfortunately was a missed opportunity. Yeah, and hey, these things happen, you know. You, yeah, you absolutely, make, you all make the, the time. You make the best play that comes to mind, you know. It's just yep, how it goes. exactly. And uh, I, Jose is not the only player who's missed something. We all have, and we all, after games, go, oh, yeah, I really should have done that, huh? In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if I go to Jose right now and he says something very similar along those lines. Let's find out. Please choose a player. Um, It has to be a res, I think. Okay. Thank you very much. Wait, wait, wait. Hold on one second. Hold on. I'm holding. You almost got me. The skills lie, and it's actually rest that's the farmer. Oh my god. Skills are so good. Oh my goodness. One could say he has skills. He does have skills. I don't think he would out it that way. You know what? I'm going to go down with it. Let's go for Dak. Okay. Thank you very much. Mm -hmm. Even. Oh dear. Even. In the weirdest way possible, skills needs to be even further nerfed. Yep. Um. I mean. Do we turn I, Dylan into the farmer? I guess. I guess. It sucks, doesn't uh, it? Yeah. This has been a rough game. Yeah. Let's go to Dylan. Hey, buddy. Hi. Uh, I'm here to tell you that you are the farmer. Hey, there it is. Awesome. Thank you. You're very welcome. Um, so I got a DM from Jose just as I was doing that saying, can I change my mind back to res? Oh, it's too late. Yeah, sorry. Um, uh, sucks. Yep, he went uh, too far into that that infinite logic loop, right? Yep. We call it we yep. call we call it the Yomi lasagna. Mm -hmm. He went a little too deep. He should have stayed on the cheesy, crusty layer on the top, but went into the first layer of noodles. Oh wait, is it sauce? Yep. What comes in that? What comes after the cheese? Is it no? It's noodles. Um, I. Mm, good going question. From, I think it might be cheese sauce noodles, and then I I don't know. Going from the top down, I'm pretty sure it's cheese noodles sauce. Uh, See, I think it's cheese sauce noodles. Uh, YouTube comments, please tell us what you think the correct order for uh, lasagna layers are. Um, Twitch chat, help in. Uh, we would love to ha hear your input because... It has. Nothing... I've, I've certainly never made a lasagna from scratch, so I'm just trying to go off of memory of having eaten lasagna, and I'm not gonna lie, it's been a while since I have eaten right, lasagna. Exactly. And that is too bad because I love ricotta cheese. Oh, it's one of the best. Um, Ryback's gonna have to pick somebody. We're gonna find out who. Uh, let's see. Please choose a player. Dylan, please. 
Who? Dylan, please. Dylan, please. You got it. Thank you very much. You. Oof. Well, I mean, that's a thing. Uh, it's noodle sauce cheese, says... Uh, uh, Frazier, what kind of lasagna doesn't have some kind of pasta Okay, noodle? so we should clarify, Fraser, because this might be a thing that people don't really realize. The, the lasagna noodle is not like a spaghetti uh the th yeah it's it's like a, a, a wide flat wide noodle. flat kind of wavy noodle noodle meat cheese Ooh, noodle meat cheese look at you look at but you. who has lasagna that has nothing on top you gotta put cheese on it right it's sauce and i'm telling you the order from top down starts off with cheese sauce noodle i said cheese sauce noodle no i said cheese noodle sauce yeah, you said cheese noodle sauce. This is gripping content. There's like 70 people watching us talking about the layers. All right, Nate's Nate's in on it with me. Cheese sauce noodle. All right, let's talk to Dak because Dak has a rules clarification. Hey, buddy. Hello. What's the Ro question? I have a rules clarification. Sure. If a no dashi poison reaches out and catches the storm caught flare. Does that player get bad information? Uh, yes. So the storm catching only prevents them from dying by ways other than execution. They don't have okay. they don't have protection from evil. Okay. No, that's that's totally fair. That's kind of what I thought. I just wanted to guarantee it or figure it out. So. Yeah. Okay. Thank you very much. No problem. I had assumed since you didn't clarify meat, I figured meat was in the sauce. I mean, you probably should assume that. Uh, yeah, it's usually uh, like a meat sauce. Yeah, it's usually a meat sauce. But you can get vegetarian or vegan uh, lasagna. It's probably a pretty popular thing. We'll ask some vegans. Uh, if you're a vegan and you're watching on YouTube, this is great, by the way. I just keep doing this, and then apparently if I just make comments and tell people to, if, to leave comments, like, I just make money. Like... I don't really care what your opinion is. Nobody, nobody does, yeah. by the way. Fraser, I don't know why you're so confused what we're talking about. Uh, Fraser saying it's like pasta sheets with meat and a sauce and cheese. The IDK, sheets, what the fuck you're talking the about? The pasta like, sheets are the noodles. That's exactly what we're talking about. The pasta sheets are yeah. the noodles. Um, if anybody on, if you ever are watching someone on YouTube and they say, well, leave a comment telling us about what the thing is that you want to know. Yeah, they don't care. And they probably won't respond to you because all they want is the comments because the comments show engagement, which shows that it boosts it up in the algorithm, etc. So you're being conned into leaving comments that people don't care about. Now that said, I do care. Sometimes. You're gonna you're gonna say that and then follow it up with, but leave a comment on ours. Tell us how you feel about lasagna, Garfield. All right, let's go. To <laughs> Let's go to uh, yes, Shade. There's there's a shocking amount of people that I have met from Southeast Michigan, including myself, uh, in the Clock Tower community. Yes, uh, shouts to shouts to to Southwest Detroit. You know where ICP is from. Uh, anyway, let's go to bed. let's go to let's go to town. Good morning, everybody. It was an exciting night. I'm just wiggling in my chair. It's so good. Um, oh, I should probably take the skull off of Kale. Uh, Dak died in the night. <laughs> really? Interesting. This thing. <laughs> That's very interesting. Yeah. yeah. Okay. So, who ended up with the farmer token last night? That was going to be my question. It was me. It's, <laughs> it's, it's, we're at final four. It went guys. back to you? I know. Yep, it's back. It was we're me, final Austin. Four, we might as well. We're at final we're four. Two? We're probably yeah. going to sleep. We're going to go to sleep. We're going to go to sleep, and whoever got the farmer token shouldn't say. Storyteller became the farmer. <laughs> it's an atheist game the whole time. Atheist, I was about to say. 
Man, imagine just if the but, storyteller could just become uh, a character. That'd be great. All right. I was uh, called an atheist. Yeah, how about that? End off tonight's game with a little title called Swords to Plowshares. Oh, nice. Look at you. Uh, I'm not going to give Swords to Plowshares as a clue. Everybody knows that one. Uh -huh. um, oh, I didn't give you guys one, did I? I did. Oh, Blood Feud. Oh, shit. I got to do that. Uh, it sounds like nobody is having any whispers. Does anybody intend on nominating tonight? We all said in chat that we're not nominating. Yeah. Um, I will Except for JR, skills. but JR is dead, so it doesn't matter. Ignore JR. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Blood Feud is a magic card. I could not find a metal album called Blood Feud. I was shocked. I also call bullshit. There's got to be one, surely. I tried. I looked on uh, Discogs and everything. I couldn't find one. That card There's... costs so much mana for its little <laughs> ability. It's an uncommon, I mean, you know. Yeah. All right. Uh, so nominations are open. No, we have no nominations coming from anyone. Okay, let's go to bed. Mm -hmm. Good, night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Oh no, Dongashan Esquire has found a metal album called Blood Feud. Aha, <laughs> proven wrong. Uh, uh, Frazier, to answer your question, as far as I know, no, Connecticut and Michigan don't have any particular beef. Um, it's just they... They're both states that suck. They're cold as fuck. Um, there's a lot of snow. Connecticut's pretty expensive. Lots of uh, drugs. Uh, sure, I suspect that's a pretty worldwide issue, though. But yeah, you know. Probably. Yeah. Shots but yeah, the they're just they're just both states that suck. I did not give a new name, Tori. If you're watching this back, because the game is over. Um, Yes, Twin Giant. Thank you, Art is Evil. Yes. Okay, guys. I fucked up. It's okay. Um, We can just refund. Can, can you refund that one? Is that a thing you can do? Uh, I don't think so. Well, shit. I think once it's gone out. Oh, but I actually haven't completed the prediction. Yeah, can you just... So never mind. Can what I can do prediction? is delete it, yes. All right, cool. You guys are not going to lose any money because of my idiocy. There you go. All your points have been returned. Returned. Okay, let's go to Jose. See what he wants to do. Hey, buddy. Hello. Who are we choosing? I am praying you made Dylan the. Actually, can Dylan change roles? Can you guys make him to something else? Um. That the mechanic. All, all the Stormcatcher does is say that they can't die by execution. Okay, okay. So hopefully, maybe um, they're the farmer now. So let's just uh, let's go for rest this time. Final answer? <laughs> yes, thank you. <laughs> yep, thank you. Okay, guys, I understand. Yes, there are... Blood Feud <laughs> is a thing. I understand, guys. Oh, there, they're giving it to you. Yeah, yeah well, this one's a band, not an album. Yeah. yeah. Buttle. Oh, that's weird. Um, Dylan... You got it. Thank you very much. The Glow of Television isn't on there, and yet there's a copy of it in our basement. I don't even know what the Glow of Television is. Rose is gonna have to sort that one out. Anyway, I think we're going. We're going back to town. Good. Good morning, town. Res is dead. Noms are open. Alright. Also, I found this uh, uh, apparently my I can do this. This is a thing. If I hit slash dog facts, I can get <gasps> dog facts. <laughs> what? Fantastic. Wait, there is cat facts. Oh, <gasps> there is cat facts. <gasps> Good. I don't know if you have to be ST or uh Thanks, Kale. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, Kale. Um, so for anybody who can't see it, Kale just did a uh, slash goose fact. Oh, I think haunts. we're gonna have to, to ask Patters to get get us a goose fact in there. I don't think there's mm -hmm. that many facts. Mm -hmm. Alright, just come up as can we, can we do seven. a round yeah. robin? Okay. I'll sure, facilitate the round robin. That. No, I'll, I'll do it, skills. That's fine. You facilitate so many round robins, I'll take care of it. But let's start with skills, just to fuck with them. 
<laughs> oh, excellent. I was the barber. Okay, Bruce. I was the farmer. Ryback. I was and remained the butler. Kale. Cannibal. Hello, we executed JR. I received a one. We executed Tori. Got a one. I executed Dakota. Got nothing. Oshan. Oh, oh, girl. Died before I got any info. Dak. Started off as the Oracle and got a zero for two nights and became the farmer. Hmm. JR. Chef with a zero. Tori. Tori's muted. Come on, Tori, just play <laughs> out of evil. Um. <clears throat> uh. <laughs> sorry. Uh, Empath, uh, got two zeros. Um, got killed so the cannibal could not exist. Done. Interesting. <laughs> All right. Uh, so I am your storm caught uh, chambermaid. Uh, I will run through my information real quick. Night one, I picked Tori. Dakota got a two. Night two, I picked Tori and Dak, and I got a one. Night three, I picked Resnora and Dak, got a one. Night four, Jose and Dak, got a one. That makes sense because Dak turned into the farmer night four. Night five, I turned into the farmer. Hey. And Dakota. And that's my information. Dakota. Dakota. I was muted. Dakota. Uh, we could not hear you, Dakota. I plead the fifth. Okay. Jose. <laughs> um, I was the seamstress. I got a no between Dylan and Ryback. And night five, I turned into the farmer. Rez. Uh, Slayer shot Dak. Dak's not evil. Or it wasn't the demon in, in, in evil, so nothing happened. Nominations are open. So it's just Jose, right? Like, yeah. I think it's yeah. Dylan, yeah. guys. Yeah. I swear it's Dylan. I think it's been the demon the whole time with the whole storm caught thing. I don't know how to prove it. And you guys don't believe it, but I don't know how to do it. Light I world. mean, if I could pat myself on the back for that one, I could. But I mean, like, I don't, I've I never didn't. played with you, Dylan, so maybe, I don't know. <laughs> I've never played with you either. Yeah, yeah, so. True, very true, very true. You're right, you're right, you're right. Is that, uh, okay, well, I think was trying to say something too. Yes, yeah, sorry, I think I interrupted somebody. Dylan possibly being an Odashi does make sense. Toy's a minion, Jr's poisoned, not giving us that chef one, and I get an actual chef one. Because that's what we executed Jr. I was gonna ask, how do we exploit that got a zero after we execute a Tori and in most worlds we've got Tori's evil mm -hmm. but we need to need to look at that and, closely and if you hold on if you say that Dylan is the um no dashy if you think Dakota is an outsider uh then Dakota being the outsider would mean Jose would get poisoned so my Jose is saying Ryback and Dylan are not on the opposite team, so Kale's information must mean Ryback has to be evil as well. I don't know yeah. that. Yeah, know and that can't be that the one. case. Yeah. Well, what if Dakota was a starting, um, whatever, minion of some kind? No. I think... Nomination. Um, it barely, it, it just barely point. works with Dakota as the Mez taining, that tried to change Tori. Second call. Or Dakota was, the or Dakota's the townsfolk, and they were turned evil. And then my information, but no, but and then my information is fine. No, but then my chef info would be a two. There's, I asked for a ST consultation last night, and the question that I asked was that if, if the Stormclot player, which is the chambermaid, ends up next to an Odashi, would their information be incorrect? And that is correct. They would get incorrect information because they are poisoned. The only storm catching about it is, is that they have to be killed or executed to be killed. 
but they can be yep. poisoned. So his, so Dylan's chambermaid information can be poisoned. Final call for mm -hmm. nominations. Um, clarification from the STs, please. Sure. Um, I'm I'm almost positive I know the answer, but I want a clarification. Um, if a Nodashi uh, is sat next to a townsfolk, and then that townsfolk turns evil, that Nodashi poison still does not move, correct? Correct. Uh, Nodashi does not care. I just want to check. Nodashi does not care about alignment. It just cares about your character type. So it just cares that they are townsfolk. So in other words, if Jose were the Nodashi here, they'd be poisoning Rez and poisoning Dakota. If Dakota's a uh, Mez turned townsfolk, yes. Yes. Uh, I, I'm 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 all in on Jose here, guys, but that's uh, me. Gonna end the day right. in five. If I'm Wait. Ryback would nominate Jose. Jose Ryback nominates Jose. Why? I think the case has already been made, so I don't need to expound on it any further. Jose, what is your defense? Yeah, it's definitely it's it's not me. I was holding on to my seamstress, hoping for that cannibal to be able to get a kind of double seamstress thing. Um, and I will be nominating. I, I actually do not know whether it's Ryback or Dylan, um, but uh, I'll let you guys decide, and hopefully you can help me out figure it out. But it's definitely not me, guys. We would need two for this to pass. Can we get five? Because if there's a turn, remember, they're getting, they can tie it with Yeah, four. they could tie it at four, yeah. Five is enough. Jose is on the block. Any other nominations? Oh. I, I can't explain Dax info in that world. Go ahead. Um, Could Dak be I, I, drunk? The drunk the that drunk. turned and into the, the farmer? In five. With the drunk. Jose will nominate Dylan. Jose nominates Dylan. Why? I I haven't believed the, the storm cut thing. I spoke with Dylan one on one. He kind of rushed a little bit for me to hard claim, and I just didn't trust it. I did have to uh, confirm with the storyteller if the Storm God uh, rule has to be in play, and they said no. Um, uh, and, and I just think they've been faking it the whole time. Again, I haven't played with Dylan, so I don't know how, how good they are at that. Um, so I can meta or social read that. Uh, but I honestly think that Dylan has been whatever demon. I don't know if it's the Nodashi. Um, the Nodashi, I think, would make a little bit of sense to me if Tori is the uh, minion and i guess that invalidates the chef uh, information uh, but that's the worldview that i have right now dylan what's your defense uh regarding my conversation with you jose uh i rushed out my role i did not rush you for your role i pre i presented the same scenario with pretty much everyone that i was talking to the first couple of days just bringing out my role and saying you can give me whatever you want um from my information since i don't have anything uh on ryback there is just the slightest possibility that it might end up being on ryback but if it is then i i don't know i really don't have any information to double down on that confidently okay we would need four or sorry five to tie or six to pass i will say that uh dylan did come out to me the same way said here's my role this is what i am you can give me whatever two is not enough jose still on the block would we like dylan would you like to nominate right back um Let's see, we currently have... Pretty please. Yes, I'll go ahead and point at Ryback. Just in the case that Ryback is the demon, uh, I would potentially vote on this, but I'm not set just yet. Ryback, your defense. Truly, I can't tell you if it's Dylan or Jose who's actually the demon, but if Good Town votes on me and causes this to flip, Good will lose. We would need five to tie or six to pass. Socially, Dylan's reading Good. Yep, socially. socially, Dylan could have poisoned me, and that's why I kept getting zeros. And would have. Doesn't that account for Jose's weird response as well? 
Right. Two is not enough. There are no more nominations that can be made. Jose, town is voted to execute you. How would you like to die? Very sad, but happy. I had fun. Very <laughs> sad, but happy. I had fun. So that just sounds like um, that kind of sounds like watching like a, a Nicholas Sparks movie. You know, like <laughs> you like watch the Notebook and you leave happy, but like you're sad. Like you're sad, but I had fun. But I had, but I'm sad. Um, we make Jose watch the notebook and it only takes about 10 minutes and he dies. Um, you want to talk sense. about bad movie takes? Uh, <laughs> Jose is dead, which means the game is over and I would like to congratulate the team that has won. It is Skills' team. <laughs> it is JR's team. Yay, I win. <laughs> it is the good team. Those, Congratulations those to the good oh. team for the good, good game, skills guys. Well lap. played. That Ooh. lap skills. Okay. This game came down Can to we the wire. Nerf skills? Please, uh, pretty please. So yes. Have tried. Evil, evil All right, has recap. come out. Alright, so let's give out a a uh, recap. Alright, um, Ooh, chat did not like my take on the notebook. Okay, let's start with Jose. <laughs> Jose, you're Nodashi, who had a poisoning of their two neighbors because both of their neighbors were townsfolk. Rez, your slayer, uh, attempted to take a shot at Dak. It wouldn't have worked even if Dak was the demon because Rez was poisoned the whole game. Skills was your barber, who was killed at night by Jose, who opted to not do the barber swap. Mm -hmm. Bruce was your starting farmer uh, who was killed and then their farmership started a farmer chain pretty late into the game. Ryback was your butler who butled to his left pretty much the entire time. Um, or sorry, to his right. I apologize. Uh, Kale was your scarlet woman. Congratulations on town killing Kale at basically the 11th hour before it actually would have mattered. So, yeah. Yeah. Well done, Town, killing Kale so that there wasn't an escape hatch for Jose. I know Town was saying if you kill Jose, then they're going to go after Kale next. But Kale did a good job of trying to deflect info and find worldviews, which was very nice. Uh, Malishan, indeed, was your flower girl who would have learned that the demon voted had they not been killed on night two. Sag. Um Dak was your starting drunk oracle. Uh, who was added in by the Balanist, which I'll get to later. Um, Dak was your drunk oracle who got bad information, suspected that they were the drunk, uh, and then was turned into the farmer. And when Bruce died, that was the first farmer jump. JR was your chef with a zero, which was correct at the beginning of the game. That was sober info. Tori was your Mezephiles, whose word was inconceivable. <laughs> Nicely done, then, Nina. Thank you. I can't. You can thank Art for that. That was all Art. That was thank all you, Art. Art. I love you. That's genius. That was That's all good. Art. Um, Tori Never gave trust to Sicilian with death is on the line. Tori was uh, given inconceivable and almost immediately ran to Dakota who graciously accepted the word. Dakota Almost was- Almost immediately, it was definitely immediate. <laughs> uh, Dakota was your balloonist who was poisoned by the Nodashi and given the Mazepheles word and Mazepheles turned on night two. Uh, they added a third outsider to the game, which was Dak, the drunk, uh, which could have flown under the radar since Dakota never claimed balloonist. Um, but basically, unfortunately, because Tori chose the player that was sitting next to a Nodashi, that player was getting poisoned info the entire game. Sag. Uh, and Dylan. Dylan started the game off as your storm-caught chambermaid who was getting sober information the entire time because Dakota was soaking up the, the Nodashi tentacle. And then when Dylan, uh, we had no further recourse and we had to throw evil a bone at the end of the game, we made Dylan your third farmer, uh, which confirmed a good chain and took away their storm-caught status uh, but there was no way of, you know, Jose being able to know that. So, right. yeah. 
Uh, and that was... I guess I could have tried to kill them, huh? I could have, yeah. That was your game of clean sweep. I like that screen. Again. Good game. Uh, game. Thank you, storytellers. Everyone else gets to speak to their spouse without question, so why don't I? <laughs> yeah, me roll. exactly. Let me talk to my wife, okay? We're being hate-crimed no. over here, Dakota. We're being hate-crimed. We're being hate-crimed, love. Dakota was your mom. No! Oh, I, don't know who not, decided... I never agreed to that. Uh, yeah, I don't know who decided Dakota was my mom. She is my hot-ass wife. Exactly. She, she is a hot-ass wife, to be fair. Um, yeah, exactly. 